What are we talking about? Practice? Y'all, you tuned in to Gorilla Cross Radio. It is with deepest pride and greatest pleasure that we welcome you tonight. What kind of place is this? I have a very good brain, and I've said a lot of things. Oh, what's going on, I stand upon my desk to remind myself that we must constantly look at things in a different way. You have my curiosity. For well, one, I don't think he knows what he's talking about. Now you have my attention. You're here. I'm here. Get on with it. All right, let's get on with it. Yes, 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 we will get on with it because I am extremely, extremely bored. What's going on, everybody? My name is James Mace. <laughs> Brittany Soul. Hot breath applause. <sighs> oh, I got one. You get it? You see what I'm saying? I, because I, I, I saw you. I saw my you. man, my man Tiangelo is not here today. Yeah, what's... I don't know. He hasn't called me back today. Um, I think he might be mad at me. Oh, you've been going in? Well, I've been kind of going in on like Big Brother style on him. Okay, for sure. And for he sure. said we was going to talk about it, so I don't think I'm at wrong with like by talking about it, but I'm not going to put his business completely oh, out there. Oh, of course, yeah. So I'm going to just put the package on your door, and you're going to be able to just kind of just tell what's going on. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, well, it's big love to T'Angelo, yeah, whatever's man, going you, on. We at? miss you. We'll uh, catch up with you later. But in, yeah. in fashion, in T'Angelo fashion, he might just show up like halfway through. Oh, good point. You know what I'm saying? That's just really the way he does it. Um, <laughs> but we do have. Special a special guest, guest in hey. the studio today. My girl E. Carice is back. Hi. How Hello. you doing? I am Tangelo reincarnated. No, please. Don't. But no, you were on time, hon. <laughs> no, just, you were early. Just be you. Just <laughs> we, be you. Just be you. I can't be Tangelo no, today. No, you, you can't. Well, uh, do you want you can, to be? She can audition. I mean, no, we could try it. Do your best. Okay. <laughs> all right. I can oppose everything that you're doing. Even okay, if you do okay. your best. Okay. <laughs> we'll <laughs> At see. At least we'll you got that part together. That could work. No, um, we also have another special guest in the building tonight. Definitely, yes. definitely. Y'all put your hands together for my man, Rare Breed. Yes. Rare Breed is in the place. Rare Breed, all the way live from California. Yeah, man. And the um, 702. How you yeah, feeling? Yeah. And the 702. And 702. Yes. Welcome to the city, man. So you just showed up today? Yeah, yeah. Just came out here for the uh, Stellar Weekend. Oh, yes. Yeah, Stellar Weekend. so busy Award. out here for that right now. It's going to be bananas. Uh, turn yeah, it up right yeah, there. yeah, yeah. Uh, oh, okay. <laughs> but yeah, so the, it, that's, that's crazy because, you know, this is the time that a lot of the um, Christian gospel, you know what I'm saying, um, inspirational artists kind of just all... Hone in on, Calif- on, on Las Vegas show right up. now. Show up. And, yeah. and, and, and really, and really do their thing. It's lights their, up, really. The gospel Grammys, if you will. Yeah. Everybody got action. Isn't that week. the Dove Awards, though? No, I think it's the Stellas. Okay. It's the Stellas. I never heard of the Dove, so I, I'm going to go heard with the Stellas. You the Dove Awards? Yeah. That sounds like the Soap yeah. Awards. Like, yeah, right. Which would kind of could be it gospel, too, because gospel, like you're clean. Like your skin's going to be moisturized. It's a gospel. <laughs> the moisturizing award. Whatever. That got you guys good. are crazy. But um, anyway, yeah, it's a, it's a lot going on in this city. Uh, do you have... I'm going to win a Stella Award one day. I just wanted to put that out there. Oh, you are? Mm-hmm. Next to Kirk Franklin? Speak life into it. Yeah, man. In, 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 in the name uh, because of my Savior Jesus, I'm going to win a Stella Award today. I, That's I, really I think you should host <laughs> it one time, too. That like, might work, too. I mean, if they like my personality. But, you know, we do a lot of crazy stuff. <laughs> um, it's, it's a little unorthodox ministry over here. We kind of get stuff done. It's like, all good. We kind of get stuff done. Yeah, we do because that's the Shit. point, right? You got to go out and do it. You got to go and do it. Like I did, I did the battle out in New York. Hey, that was pretty cool. You just did that this past weekend. I did that on uh, the. I forget what date it was. The tenth. It was the tenth. Like yeah, that. same day I did rhymes. Yeah, that's no, right. it wasn't the tenth. That's, that's a lie. It was the ninth. I don't remember. It was. It, it was. The it 11th? recently happened. Okay. Get the li- he really did. It was that really weekend. No, I really did. <laughs> no, I'm so proud of you, really James, because you went out to to represent. Um, well, kind of. Okay. But the Vegas. reason why the tenth the tenth rings right. in my mind because that's the day I hurt my leg. Oh. So it just rings. It's just. Was it the thirteenth? Is that the same day you got your handicap sticker or no? No, no, no. I didn't get the. I didn't get that till like two weeks later. You know, it's an application process. Okay. <laughs> First of all, <laughs> I need to know this process. But anyway, um, so tell us how that battle went. Representing the, the West Coast and the New York, a mostly East Coast. Definitely, it was battle. crazy, crazy. Hey, oh. Tiangelo just Come in Wakanda rock. style. Damn, <laughs> Wakanda forever. Where you been? He's so R and B. All right. Good energy. Oh, oh Lord. Oh. He's been on this energy kick all day. Well, I, I guess it. I can't be Tangela today. You can, well, no. we just thank God for that. And, and it's, and <laughs> no. Rise. No, you're going to get him Tiangelo, did you bring vibranium with you? I don't know if you guys can see him on the live. I just need y'all to see uh, Tangela. If y'all can see him on the live, he is hey. really out here he rocking the vibranium. He that movie a couple times. Super <laughs> T'Challa shirt. Ooh. Am I just going to chill right here? There's no, you're going to get a chair and then just get right there. Yeah, but he's super out here with the t- 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 T'Challa. T'challa. 
Chala. No, he's uh, late, late, late Chala. Yeah, late. he's always late Chala. Yeah. But whatever the case was, so I did the <laughs> event out there, um, over, yes. Overflow Rap Battle League. I love it. Um, it was one of their first events. Um, the event was called Iron Sharpens Iron. Mm. Uh, it, was, it was it was hosted by um, the Saga uh, hip hop battle artists as well as a hip hop just recording artist. Mm -hmm. Dope, um, dope, dope event, man. Uh, a lot of Christians in the building. We just kind of represented ourselves. You know, this this battle thing is coming up. You know, hip hop battle scene is coming up, and there are a lot of hip hop battlers who are Christian who go out into regular yeah. battle. I guess if you want to call them secular battle, right, quote right, unquote, right. and go out and to do their thing. So this was just this one was called Iron Sharpens Iron. It may okay. be a little bit once again unorthodox, but God was praised through the whole thing, man. It was an amazing event. Um, they did four battles. Um, we did the first battle. Okay. This is the first battle for that league. So I kind of made history in that in that uh. Hey. Let's go. In that and so that, that was here. dope. And um, I don't know. It was just amazing. It was amazing. A lot of love in the room. You know, what I'm saying a lot of bars in the room. If you think Christian hip hop battle. It was only you know geared toward four people. You got you, you definitely got it wrong. Got so it definitely wrong. up and comers coming in. Yeah, I'm one That's of them. That's what's up, James. I'm, we're hold so on, proud hold on. of you. Say that again. Say that again. I'm one of them. You one of them? Yeah, yeah I'm yeah. one of them. You you the one. I'll be that. You the one. Neo. <laughs> <What's> um, <laughs> <laughs> no, but we're so proud of you, James. I mean, I've said that several times. I'm gonna say it probably several more. But like you out here representing, I appreciate and I you, love man. it. You're one of my top five. That's your, what's up. Your energy, James. I look. <laughs> all right, so T'Angelo will be on his energy kick all day. What's that oh, about, T? What's gonna, going on? We don't name this show. I What's, am energy. I'm what? telling y'all right now. That's what this is. I am energy. energy? I, I'd already seen the visual and everything. Oh. T'Angelo, meet the people who are in the room. You got, of yes. course, Icaris, who you know. Hey. Man, I, I saw Icaris, like, like in my mind before I even got here, so... We already like said what's up. I don't to even want to. I don't because, even. Yeah, I don't because, even want to. Let's not <laughs> dissect that right because, because, yeah, because the energy. Because <laughs> energy. Because energy. So, and then we got rare breed. <laughs> rare breed. And I was gonna name rare my, breed. Uh, I was gonna name my song Certified Woman Rare Breed first. Yeah. But it was already took it. And I think it was you, brother. Uh oh. No, so, that's kind of his name, not <laughs> not, not the that's name, not of the name of the song. Of a song. I'm, I'm just saying. We yes, but Rare Breed is a Christian hip hop artist. Uh, dope, dope. Uh, super dope. Outside, based in California and Vegas, right? Yeah. I mean California, but I've, I've been in Vegas doing a. He comes I got history in he Vegas. He does a lot of. Okay, I got history. So kind of like, uh, Cali Vegas. <laughs> Cala Vegas. I mean, you're hilarious, Brittany. We sound like the same world. But like, you know what? These we don't want to be in a box. We want to be worldwide. Second exactly. of all. Exactly. Second of all. This growth, this growth yes. happened yes, here. Honey. Talk yes, honey. Yes, because honestly, it. I don't like when people call me local. I don't like it. I, I hate local artists. I'll be I called a native all in, day long. What if you from the city and you in the city? Listen, Can you just be local at that point? Listen. No. Listen, I'm telling you. You don't want to be local. I, don't, I say I'm native all day long. Okay. Don't call me local. Ooh. Don't call me a local artist because I'm an international artist. Let me interject. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I just feel. Sure? I'm not feel saying like I'm gonna be calling a, you out your name. I don't feel like I'm. But but it, you're local. saying that it kind of boxes no. you in. No, no, that's no, what I'm. It kind of it kind of makes it seem like oh you're a Las Vegas artist. No no, no and we I don't and I don't. Right? Let me just say this. I don't mind being known as a Vegas artist. But mm -hmm. what I'm saying is that one like ninety percent of the time when people say oh a local artist they literally view you like this. The person saying it. I'm not even talking about anyone else. It's your mind frame is not acceptable. Yeah. Speak that energy. All right. So so so. But yeah, yeah, and and I definitely agree with you. I hated the term, but I didn't know how to go about telling people. Oh, I don't like being called a local artist. Uh, I would get say, out of town. I would say, I would say, <laughs> yeah, right, exactly. I, I will. Um, they can't I, call you local if you ain't from there. I feel you, but I mean, if you're from here and then you're still doing shows out of town, you can. Yeah, I, I always say I'm gonna be an international artist. They like, oh yeah, that's what's up. But I didn't believe it like that. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So. Just give your mini bio and boom. Exactly. <laughs> that's Put what I did. Why does his bio good? have to be mini? I know. Well, thank you, Ikari. Like they, a local artist. You know why I got to be mini? This is shout out to everybody who's ever hosted an event because I don't want to sit up there and, and just oh, say, exactly. yes. born January 17th, 1984. <laughs> At, at 315. Yeah. That's called pontificate. Yeah. 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 Oh, word, yeah. word of the week. We all, we, <laughs> yeah, that was a good word. But we got three things about you. I like that already. That these people want to know. Yeah, no, full bios for background, but. But for the just the host announcing it, mini bio for sure. Well, yeah. we, also, we also want to keep in mind um, when people say local, they're not trying to, you know, they're some, not dissing. They're not, they're some not of them have the wrong mindset, no, I, I, I and that's it, what but, bothered but me. I don't, I don't they're think, not trying to diss. So I don't so. think it's the people who say local artists that's the issue. It's, it's when you caught. people hearing it, Ooh, it, it, it kind of that's when it that's limits. Good, you. But but in order to control what people hear, you you if you have influence on what people are saying, then you absolutely yeah absolutely. I don't think that people are intentionally saying, oh, you're a local artist. Just saying, hey, you know, hey, we're Tangelo, the local city. artist. No, I'm not a local artist. <laughs> I'm gonna be international. I'm gonna be known Amen. throughout the world. 
So you should, like well, right so now, you are international. Speak it to an exactly. But technically, right existence. now you're not even local because you're not even from Vegas. <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not even speaking it to. Real talk. He's not from Vegas. I'm speaking it to Vegas. Local just means in in town. The feeling is is there. So everywhere you perform, you local. If you live there, are you? Do you live there? Can you go to the it, high roller at the link and show them the ID and get the little discount? Then you local. <laughs> hey, all I have to hey, say is I take that local discount any day. It's <laughs> Usher. It's such a random. Okay. Hey, we get ten. Was Usher here ever on a local I... artist? Was yeah. Beyonce ever a local artist? Yeah, to Dallas, to Houston. How long? Though? How long were they local what? though? My bad. This you is know amazing. You you company company how long? How long were they local though? Really? Wait, real quick though. I don't you know. can I be. Think you just stop that term. Local real quick, artist, you can if be really trying to make it. You can be hater. local and international. That's not the point. Local just means you. You know, just. I meaning, know, but but know. I don't want to just. Just be don't call Britney local. Don't. <laughs> but she or is local. local. She is local lo though. Local. She's definitely she local. 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 Ask, local. Ask that piano. Indeed. Su madre. Ask that piano. Anyway, <laughs> is that a shot? Let's. That was pium pium. I thought it was tu madre. Tu madre. It's all of them. Su tu. All of Did it. you just do, do a gang sign? Yo, Sue, mama. Blue. Whatever the case is. Yo, let's get back Shout to Shout out to everybody, mama. That's what's up. Much Shout out to, to everyone's everybody. mom and their local uh, fellowship halls. So. <laughs> oh, so you call other people local. <laughs> Kettle calling the black. Wow. What did you do this wow. weekend? Yeah, man. And, oh. why are you, and why are you late? Tell that story. I'm late because I'm great. <laughs> mm. Mm. I'm just pretty sure I'm that's right. not how late. the song went. No, but what, what have you It's all fake. To? It's the T'Angelo way. It's the T'Angelo way. There you go. ATP. Look me up. I have this thing about <laughs> Look up the definition. people being late. I know you Can do. You, I Look. will stop dating someone. Oh, you, oh, you want to late. date me? You don't have... <laughs> I, girl, you want to date me? It's girl. like if you... If you Is that what's happening? I'm Is like, that you, you don't heard? respect our time? Mm -hmm. Then I got a concern here. Mm -hmm. you know? I respect minutes and not just hours. <laughs> That's a bar. Bars. Was that, was that a bar? Come on now. <laughs> that was bars. Okay, but as long as you can make a girl but laugh, it's also a lie. Yeah, she'll, she'll appreciate it. But, 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 but if you're if you're late, late, late to every date. No, not every date. Just 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 a couple. No, we're good. Mm -hmm. Just a couple. All yeah. right, well, you're lost. So 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 you were <laughs> you was all, late. Tangela was late a little bit. First and that's okay. It's okay. I came at the right time, man. I threw the you know, the end. Yeah, so but no, um, I don't know what's going on right yeah, now. Yeah, so Tiangelo I'm glad. Just, he, he, want to, he don't want to answer the question. Why was you late, I brother? I did answer the question. Oh, I didn't. His I didn't. energy was, was oh, here. Oh, I was late because I ain't got no car. Oh. I okay. had to lift it down here. That's and I ain't up. had no no uh, no no uh internet, so I had to go somewhere with internet. <laughs> you really want to know the answers? Ta in you ain't got the answers, James. I don't. Tangelo's you ain't got the answers, James. Tangelo's in a transitional moment in his life right now. We I should am. have an intervention at the end of the show. No, but For you guys just speaking about <laughs> just speaking about what's transpired since our last show. Um, I performed at Cork and Thorn, which is a, a spot out here in Tivoli Village. I went Village to make it a few times. Shout out to Cork and yeah, Thorn. Yeah, you did want to make it. Uh, Beautiful I setting, beautiful setting it. there. <laughs> sorry, but James friend. Mays made it. I definitely did. One it foot was his and all. birthday. <laughs> One so foot and all. Happy gonna... birthday to you. Yeah, okay. No, I don't want another I man to say it to me. All right. Go ahead, Britt. <laughs> exactly. E. Reeves was there. I saw her. Hey, guys. I'm going to make it up to everybody. How about that? <laughs> his face. It's all about um, But I on. performed at Cork and Thorn. We actually had another uh, successful event, yes, which is nice. Carice's event called Rhymes, dope, Spoken dope. Word with a Twist. That, that she, went down. That she gave nice. me the side eye when she was like, you got to come. And I'm just like, I'm going to come. I was just I was in the hospital. I was, <laughs> She's I was like, like unacceptable. <laughs> right. It's not acceptable at all. So. Your oh, doctor could have come too. <laughs> I, heard, I, heard the day, I heard it the day of the I event. I wasn't even there. So oh. Yeah, this most recent event, she was out of the country living life. That's like, what's up. So she's not Where'd local. you go? So she left dirty <laughs> work for me. Look, she done. Not she done graduated. Right. right. Where'd you go? What, what, what's up? I went to Costa Rica. Mm -hmm. Costa Rica. Uh, it was a good time. It was yeah. chill. That sounds like a good look. Was it? Was it with the weather? Was the weather good what, there? It's their summertime. So. Nice. Oh, so you, you 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 was just looking at all the dudes. Yeah. Huh? And it's real yeah. tropical. You know what I'm saying? So you looking at like uh, what's all the Costa Rica? What's dudes. the line? In, you looking at equator weather? Right, we yeah. were. We were on the equivalent. Yeah, right, we were. We were on the equator. So it's always good. Equilibrium. Ninety. Yeah, you real good. It was perfect. It was perfect. It was a good time. Man, I'm that's jealous. amazing, man. Got got a little uh, virus when I uh, oh, came got a little back. sick. Okay. Oh, that's yeah. crazy. Don't drink. Oh, that's crazy. <laughs> <laughs> you, you still want to? You, you want to date right up. now? <laughs> <laughs> oh, you got a cough already? Right, I'm passing so I'm along. But you, but you it, got this vibranium. virus impacts yeah, your dude, stomach. Like you know. got vibranium. You need though. the purple heart. That's yeah. what you need. Purple heart. Ah <laughs> uh, man. So, so yeah, well, there was that. There was rhymes. Um, there was a drummers international festival, which I also performed at. Busy Brit. That was amazing. And uh, most decorated. There most, was... de most, <laughs> the most, de decorated most decorated. Most decorated. Brittany always performing. Man. There was oh, one dope. more too. I feel bad. That... Oh, Sunday vibes at the Sunday Urban Vibe. Lounge. I was invited to come and get down dope, with their live dope. band, Her Soul. Yeah. I mean, just 
I've been I've been busy. I've been having fun though. Which we love though. We love the fact that yeah. you get an opportunity to get out here, show yourself. Yeah, and, and also make opportunities for other people, right? Isn't exactly. that the point of being a president? For real. For real. Exactly. Oh, I'm okay. just kidding. You the president? <laughs> I'm just kidding. It's not she a title. You want to throw around? Go ahead, Michelle. Uh, Go ahead, Michelle days. Obama. I don't want to. Oh, be he's not looking real good would when you, it comes to his uh his case. Would you guys be a president? <laughs> I, I would. Know. I don't know if I want that job. I would be a president. Would you be a president, sir? I would now. My own country, yeah. For your own country? What kind of? Not for like, the United States. One, one that you made okay. up. Okay. United States. Like Pretoria yeah. from what, the what's, family guy. Yeah. What's, your, what's your country? Huh? What's We're, your country? The breeding. You got to build one. I mean, you got to create one. Yeah, oh, nice. Good. I like that. You got to like go that. find. He's waiting, he waiting for like, a like volcano to no, erupt 20, somewhere in the ocean so he can create some land. Dope, dope. There's what? Unclaimed? There's plenty. Of, yeah, there's plenty of them. So yeah, I can make a, buy an island. You tell me I can make a Wakanda. How much money you got right now? Crowd like, share. I got, I got about sixteen dollars. Thirty dollars on me right now. I got a twenty. I got a twenty. And a parking pass. <laughs> I got a dub. I got anyway. a dub. Parking pass. Anyway, so that's minus five because you got the tip to do. <laughs> minus ten because I got to pay you too. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. That's right. Um, <laughs> Reverie, how was your week? How how have you? Changed, my, my weekend was good. Um, I actually was blessed to go inside. Um, uh, inside the uh prisons we went to um juvenile hall and other prisons down in nice. lancaster california oh in lancaster yeah, through, okay um, Cal- through the bill glass ministries they um they actually that blessed me to come familiar. yeah they've been around for 40 some years they okay. go into the prisons they bring yeah nash cars bikes they do all kind of stuff and so i'm blessed to be a platform guest over there and um nice and we just lead people to christ in in, in a we try not to be too preachy and minister to mm-hmm. them as much. Churchy. But at the same right. time, when you speak in truth, you minister to That's the people. Real. That's real. Yeah. That's, right? That's all it is, right? That's all it is. That's all it is. It's true That's energy. That's good. That's all it is. Whatever truth it is, you know what I'm saying? It's how I grew up. It's going to be the truth that I know. Yeah. So if I'm sharing that, then it just makes it relatable. Mm-hmm. It resonates with people. You know what I'm saying? So that's amazing, brother, that you're still out here doing this. Um, Since we've made this transition, <laughs> since we made this wonderful transition, can we get into some music? We got to get into hey. some music. Yeah, because definitely. like I said, my man is out here for the Stella Awards. Yeah. Yes. Hey. He's doing amazing things. Um, Got a couple shows lined up. We'll talk about those on the other side. Okay. But I definitely want to get into some of this music. You want to in- introduce this song? Yeah, this song is uh, I collaborated with uh, Unity Era. Mm-hmm. It's a movement as well. They got apparel as well as the music movement. Um, it's called Forever Unity. It's a call to unity for the whole community. Uh, we actually shot a video live with um, real, real footage of a, a real peace ride that we do every fourth Sunday in yeah. LA. Nice. And, uh, you know, it's just calling people to unity. It's Forever Unity featuring myself, Rare Breed, and uh, Terry from Unity Era. All right. All right, you guys on the other side of the break. This is Rare Breed with Forever Unity. Let's get it. And you gave me what? Trapped in the dark, you made my name smart. Jesus, the name got me out of this rut. Studied his worst, you regained my trust. Still kill and destroy. That I'm no longer part of. Unified, bank, peace and deploy. Got soldiers mounted to spread true love. Tired of seeing babies losing their lives. With no winning chance, losing the game. Gave a new meaning when coroners come with the murder stance. Zip the bodies of such a tragedy. Across the world, not just in Cali. Bring a template, prosperity. Stop looking at me like your enemy. Unite hoods as a nation, be family. Bring pride back to community. Re-educate, let your mind go free. Lifting his name with you, E. Switching it up and we giving you Christ. Shaking the devil up off of your feet. Raising your hands, never taste of defeat. Everywhere we go, we need a town to tell, to tell everyone you know. Unity is forever. Coming together, we giving you life. Switching it up and we giving you Christ. Shaking the devil up off of your feet. Speak raising your hands, never taste of defeat. This movement ain't moving without you. Stop living light. Your life has no value. Move by the masses. It's way more powerful. Disconnect. Got us down with spiral. We just need to learn what to support and follow. Need to be on and not backstab a borrow. War bigger than essays. Bloods and crit flags been waved. We now call them governments. Let's give life a chance. No more make it enemies, murder and friends. Become united in peace. Let pride, ego, and hate be released. Resolve conflicts. They're healthy for growth. Quit running like cowards that's serving them both. Dividing attempts to bring unity. That's called giving Satan victory. Everywhere we go, we need a town to tell, tell everyone you know. Unity is forever. Coming together, we giving you life. 
switching it up and we giving you Christ. Shaking the devil up off of your feet, raising your hands, never tasting defeat. Everywhere we go, we need to come together, tell everyone you know. Switching it up and we giving you Christ. Shaking the devil up off of your feet. Raising your hands, never tasting defeat. Fight for your life. Stand for a cause. Peace in the world. Could end war. We need to unify. Unify. We need to unify. Unify. Shaking the devil up off of your feet, raising your hands, never tasting defeat. Everywhere we go, we need a town to tell, tell everyone you know, unity is forever. Coming together, we giving you life, switching it up and we giving you Christ. Shaking the devil up off of your feet, raising your hands, never tasting defeat. Back. What up, though? Yo, what's going on? That was Rare Breed. Yes, honey. Hey, what did you hear? Uh, or, why is your mic? Oh yeah, there we go. My mic is out because the devil trying to trying to take me down. He's a that's, hater. That's what it is. He's a hater. <laughs> no, nah, but um, it's it's real loud now though. But uh, I heard I heard something about disconnect and uh, that was real. You know that that uh, oh, yeah. stuck with me right there. That was real. So yeah, was can fun. you tell us how that song came about, brother? Yeah. Um, we actually went to the studio, Unity Era, Era Studio in uh, Orange County, California, and uh, we were going to record other things. And while we were we were in there. Things start building, and you know it was other. It was somebody else on the song that you know actually um, we we took off the song, and um, just do the differences. And um, the brother was making the track while we were in there, mm -hmm. just vibing. And then he came up with the track, and we all wrote in there something I really don't like to do because I like to study when I write. You know. So you take you prefer to take the beat home. Yeah, and just study because I I don't I don't like the the babble. I don't like you know to just say nothing. You know I, I really mm -hmm. like to be relevant in what I say far as gotcha, teaching gotcha, the word. Gotcha. You know, it's not about making people dance, but if that happens, mm -hmm. it happens. At, the music that I make is for people to listen and learn from it and get a and get a um a testament from it, you know, right. based on everything that I've been through. So we, we wrote that, we came together with that and it just vibed and did what it was supposed to do and we just wanted to represent Unity Era and get them out there doing what they did. So we blessed Unity Era with that. Was it a West Coast collab? It was um yeah it was um actually the the girl singing on it Terry she's Polynesian she's been in uh Unity Era a uh, group and then they they kind of divided doing ministry and things like that and right. she's still holding it down and then the um producer that's with Unity Era uh they both co-founded Unity Era together and um they holding it down while the other people going out doing other God given things that's what's up man that's what's up yeah. I do I do want to say something about what you said I'm I'm that way too I like to take it home. I like to think about my words, my lyrics, and everything. Yeah. Um, that that's a way I do it too. But you're um, real good but on the spot, though. I, yeah, I'm, I'm I'm decent. I think everybody's real good on the spot if they feel it. <laughs> uh, all, yeah. all you gotta do, all you gotta do, is get into the music and 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 feel it, and 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 trust yourself, trust yourself, and and just feel it. You know, especially you you yeah. you you got that belief in God, so and you just gotta believe He gonna work work. You know what I'm saying? Work through you. So just feel it in the moment. And just, you know what I'm saying? You might come up with that melody there and then take it home. You yeah. But me? I like that. I like that. To, yeah. to, just feel it. Just to put to be both ways. Both. Yeah. I was both just ways. about to say, anyway. I like both. Yeah. Because yeah. you yeah. may not, I can write to probably any track. That doesn't mean I want to, yeah. I want it to and be attached to And she says that humbly. Exactly. Yeah. No, no, no. Uh -huh. But I don't mean it like that. The point I make I know, is I that everything yeah. you write is not necessarily, you know what I mean? Like, just yeah. like you and have to And that's not my element. That track right there is more of a new, I'm an old school West Coast. There type of person. <laughs> and, that. That's timeless, and, and so and so for me to come into that element and do something on a newer something track yeah. and be able to you know be um transparent enough to switch it up and do that yeah you know i like to go outside the box so. absolutely i think you're timeless man i think you're timeless i, I think we it. all are yeah. yeah but we all got Let's an origin it. speaking of origin man how long yeah. you been doing this how long you been doing um gospel hip-hop um actually first and foremost i never aspired to be a rapper okay and oh, um, i did a lot of writing in prison didn't know why hmm and uh, didn't know God was preparing me for this. Right. Uh, my first Saturday home, I came to a place called um, um, Club Judah from mm. a guy I was raised with, and he did an open mic thing, and I enjoyed it because I just right. like I like music, you know. Period. Mm -hmm. 
And through sitting through that, I was like, what is my biggest purpose and worth for being here? Why am I here? Not just to support all these brothers. Right, right, right. And then fellowship with all these dudes that I didn't know how to. Club Judah is in, is that Long Beach? That was in Los Angeles. It's no longer around. No, I don't, okay. Um, you know, they sold a building. What part? And, what part? You know, uh, South Central. I knew you were going to say South Central. That's well, where I'm from. South L.A. The, now, hey, you know, the, off the, of Western. The, the, the energy. Yeah. I, I just knew it. I just knew it, dog. Yeah, so All right, let's get it. Let's he get said it. Los Angeles. Yeah. But South Central, though. So I started there, and then through that, it just became it just became a passion that became a purpose. Nice. And, and everything else I did followed that and stayed full circle. I became music for the movement when I sat at the tables with intervention and gang prevention nice. and Dope. wanted to help do something in my community. But I didn't have a tool, but God gave me this tool first, and then mm. I acquired the other tools that I got that I help in the community with. But uh, this voice for for the movement where homies ain't going to church, so mm. you got to give them that beat. Yeah, you know, we, yeah, we do yeah. the, Me personally, I do remixes when I want to steal from the devil, not because I want to mimic what the world is doing. Taking it back. And so that's the type of stuff that I do. Um, if I do a remix track, is because I want to show people it's not about the content, it's about the beat that you was trying you know, that had you going. Mm. And so now when we do something like a YG beat or something and the kids is jumping around, they don't know <laughs> what they singing about. So now when you put God on it, you put a little Jesus on it, so you can still have that beat and just have something else feeding your spirit. Right, right. You, you know smart. Right. You real smart. Right. I do have a question That's for good. you, Rare Breed, and, and I don't know, you know, if all the listeners know what your story is, but I'm curious to know, like, how did you end up in this place where you are right now? I mean, you mentioned that you were in prison. Yeah. Uh, how did you get to how how did you end up in prison? I mean, I think I mean I need to know. Actually, the the reason why I embraced Vegas because pretty much every case I ever caught was in Vegas. Huh. I lost I lost okay. a best friend a month after I graduated, and I lost my way even further. Wow. And it landed me out here doing a lot of I things to this environment, mm -hmm. and I want to pour back into it. What 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 I helped you know I kind of helped you know just really with the genocide thing out here, mm -hmm. and um, you know it was around the era with. Uh, Tupac passed away. Wow. Uh, he got mm -hmm. murdered, rather. And um, yeah, actually, that same month, I got I got my first felony and went to the feds. Really? And, and I lost I lost all my twenties in the in the penitentiary. Mm -hmm. And so through that consecration moment, sitting still and learning what that is, I wanted to do better. Right. I, so I started learning things. I started tapping into older cats, saying, "What am I gonna be down the line? Right. Who yeah. am I twenty years down the line?" And I seen a lot of Brothers 40, 50 years old, still acting like me at 20 years old. Was it some, was it people inside or was it people on the outside? It was a little bit of everybody. Both, yeah, yeah, yeah. It was a little, it was, it was people. Um, I had, I had a, a dear, I call her my sister. Um, she said something to me that just, just stuck with me when she said I was keeping it real to a game that wasn't keeping it real with me. Ooh. Oh, that's good. And that just sat on yeah. me for so long. And that's I good. Said, and I said, you're right, but but since I chose the game, I'm going to play by the rules, and God willing, if I get a second chance, I'm going to play the game different. And the mm. game I choose is the people that was loyal to me. Right. And so that's the people that pick up the phone, you know, sent the money. If they sent the money, you know, came to visit, things like that. So being dedicated to that, I just wanted to do something different. And in prison, I was doing the things that I did now. Yeah. You know, so I didn't understand that I was, I was helping shift things on the yard. That's kind of what was my and, next question, wow. too. Do you find that your authenticity – of just who you are and how you came up, not really changing from that, just obviously changing the message and then being, you know what I'm saying, having this anointing about yourself. Does that, Do you find that that's an easier way of going? Not being a follower, is it? You okay. you don't want to, I always taught, I was always taught, you know, even in the gang life, they jump you on, catch you slipping. Oh, you from the neighborhood now? No, we had a fight. We're going to have a whole bunch of those. So to have that heart to understand I'm not going to do things because you making me do stuff. Gotcha. So that's that's how all this stuff came about. I don't want to be the person where they say, oh, we're going to hide something from you in the book. You know, and that's mm. that's their biggest joke where that's, they say they hide it from us. Right there. Yeah, they you said know? you want to want to hide the, the truth from uh, black exactly. people. Put it in the book, right? And I picked up so many books. I read, I read you know, that in the book. And I'm even sorry. in the Word, the first thing I picked up in – in jail was the Bible because I didn't want to do, I didn't want to function with nothing else going on. Unfortunately, I was fighting over a TV that was snatched out of a wall I'd never seen. And, uh, <laughs> you know, but those are the politics. Some things you got to gravitate to, some things you, I say no to. Right. I'm not, I'm not going head over the hill with this dude when we out here killing each other on the streets, but we, we go into a prison and we gotta we gotta link up and we gotta go against other races, but we we at each other's throat, killing each other on the mm -hmm. street. Right. I said if we piecing in here, we piecing on the streets. Yeah. And so I, I just changed a lot of those those politics when I wherever I was at, and I stood for what I felt was right. I'm not gonna just do something because they say 
hey, that's what we doing. Mm-hmm. And same thing with being, I'm, I'm always outside the box. Mm-hmm. So being bold enough to say, I'm going to push this piece. I didn't denounce my community. I'm still from my community. But I want to do, you do what you want to do, I'm going to do what I want to do. Right. That's real. And so I push peace and productivity. If I want to try to get a pocket park in the hood, I want to shut it down, put a stage on, on the block and yeah. put some turkeys and get some bikes out here, some low riders, get some resources out here. It's my hood too. I want to do that. You know. Exactly. So that's that's, that's the dynamics of, of how, I, how I think where you're not going to push me out of nothing because, you know, we was we was tricked in the wrong and I got to trick people back in the right. It's an evasive <laughs> thing. It's I'm, funny. I'm, 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 that's an interesting way to put it, actually, yeah. because sometimes you have to go ahead, T. I'm sorry. No, that was good. Ahead, that was good. I like, I like you talking. Go ahead, girl. Yeah. Go ahead. So meanwhile, <laughs> while they figure out who wanted to have I'll, I'll talk, talk, maybe I'll jump. No, what I was going to say, yeah. what I was going to say is, um, everything that you, and this, this goes for everybody in the room. Any, everything that you want to do, everything that you want to do, it, it, and it's not just what you want to do right now. It's what you wanted to do when you were at your biggest dream state, as far as like. Man, when when you was maybe nine years old, oh, I want to do this. I want to be bigger than Beyonce or whatever. Go back to that mindset. Go back to that feeling. Feel that and believe that and never, never uh, get that up. And so everything that you say you're going to do, you're going to do it. It's n- it's not by accident As that you you're should. in the room yeah. right. with us right now. Definitely. And your name is Rare Breed. So yeah. that's, it, that, it was I feel tough. like everything I'm a Rare Breed too. So, well, you know we saying? all so, are. We exactly. all are. Exactly. And, and, I, and what I do is basically me being outside the box of my selfishness because I'd rather be sitting in the corner I was the dude at the party back in the days on the wall, just posted up. You know, I didn't want. You know, I didn't learn how to dance because I didn't want people looking at me. You well, you know, got the, you got the slick hair. The girls just gonna yeah. come up to you and be I like, "Hey, what's up? What's up?" Yeah. He took I a shot at the Hawaiian suit. Yeah, yeah he it's cool, man. I wish I had that. Light skin back here, bro. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. <laughs> not after Black Panther. Hey, man. I mean, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> hey, Drake. Drake, keep me all strong with guys playing. Oh no. Keep me all strong. You don't want him as your banner. Not at all. Not at all. All right. So as you go into these, you know, these these venues, do you? get a lot of pullback from the church do you do you see that that's happening because some people some people say they bought it ain't really about it yeah um i get the pullback because for one they're not about it and then if you if you are authentic you're gonna pull it out and you're mm. gonna expose them so a lot of them don't want you there mm. um mm. they they want to call you for your little flaws but at the same time we're not gonna we're not gonna minimize the list right if we all we all fall short from our sins and we all in a hospital we not in here because we fixing and, and you gonna be pointing fingers at me. Right. So I'm a, I'm That's gonna a pull point. that I'm gonna pull that list over that you pull to the side because all you got is fornication, adultery, and drunkenness and all that. You got that that regular list, but you act like you know defiling your body with with a cigarette or a certain mm-hmm. meat and all that stuff don't fall. We all right we all fall the short at the end of the day. Yeah. So you got all these people that. They that's holding and grabbing onto a Bible and turning their back on me, but the people in that Bible are people like me. Right. You know, hey, it's, it's it's so many dirty, tainted yeah. people that got clean that's in that word, and you looking at me when we out in the community doing doing the groundwork. Yeah. And I I never look I never saw Jesus asking people where the nearest church is. Hey, Amen. Yeah, you know what I mean? So <laughs> I'm man. I'm not really compelled to go into the churches, but if that's where I'm at, and I'm 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 You're for just it. Not I'm all for You're it. You're just no. not limited. Did Jesus read the Bible? Okay. Uh, what? Okay, Tian. Yeah. I'm just asking a question. He was well. He was well versed. I'm be? glad. No, I, 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 I was <laughs> just about to, to retract my statement. Uh, but yeah. Did, so, I, and, but I, I, I do love that man. <laughs> I remember my pastor said, you know, Jesus was in a family full of hustlers. <laughs> yeah. Like tramps. He was on the block. Don't play us. Ray, Ray, Ray he was a hustler. They, they were. They were hope. He was in yeah, the church. Like, 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 but these people. I'm not just talking about the people. He, these were people who was family. This is people who was before. And he was. was com- and he was comfortable around the murderers, yeah. the rapists, the killers. Exactly. Was authenticity. But when you are genuine, it, you're not. Wow. Certain things don't. You know what I mean? Like it, things don't affect you the same way. When, and, and unless you're trying to be something. And I salute you for that too, bro. And he's yeah. covered. And he's covered. And based on 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 beliefs like how Jesus walked through this earth and walk with all these people. I'm I'm mindful of where I go mm-hmm. when I go into these situations to create peace with people that don't want peace. Mm. And I know the enemy is there and somebody's going to lash out at you. And and if your if your if your prayer and your faith is strong when you walk up in there and you in there for the right reason, you exactly. covered. You and not covered. only that, but it is. It I think is, I think perspective, generally speaking, especially related to ministry, general perspective, we can be focused on infighting and whose church is not doing this or whose ministry is want, doesn't want that or whatever. Uh, but when someone comes in and they got like a demon possession at that time, it's who cares? Exactly. Is the exactly. point I'm making. Okay, so who's gonna deal with that? 
Yeah. And that's the thing about it. Like, we've seen stuff like that. And people not equipped because some of these churches are them last day right. churches that God going to come get and knock down first because a lot of people in here faking this Christianity stuff. Right. And that's why, I come, like me, I'm I'm buck. As soon as you tell me something and you out of church and you just being, and I don't see you outside the church, then I'm going to buck on you. I'm I don't want to hear that. Right, right. Because you, you're not even following. You're the not rules. out here. I get these calls three right. in the morning. I get these calls from these these these. Um, I work with the mayor with the grid program, gang reduction, youth development. So I get the calls with these murders, right. and I gotta go out there. I gotta get these phone calls because of what I do. People inspired, like, hey, tap into him. He can help you out. And I gotta be a resource for the mother that that don't know why her son in the hospital paralyzed, why they killed her son. You know, can we get some justice for the three-year-old baby that that these people haven't even right. arrested this? One of my yet. favorite parts about it is that you're still young, though. You know what I'm saying? So you're 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 relatable in that. Like, if I can see somebody that I can look at and say he's not so far away from where I was, and he talk like me, you know what I'm saying? He dress like me. Yeah. I'm willing to listen to that person. Exactly. Sometimes, and, you know what I mean? When you just come in and you got the suit on, yeah. and, and you know what I'm saying? You got a, a whole bunch of grays. You, it's like my uh, granddad. You hating on the grays? Wait a minute. You hating on the wait. grays? No, but wait. you... You know what I'm saying? Don't, don't, like, don't, get, don't get lost in the idea that maybe your hair turned gray a little bit sooner But like, like for instance, but I wear... You know like, like, I, wear like, I still rock a tee. I still rock a tee, but I got to <laughs> let me live on it. And the homie's going to ask a question about my tee. <laughs> right. And I put it on the back, too, because people shooting you in the back. And like I got every color... And this is the apparel that I do for my organization. There's a familiarity because, there, right? You because now when people see it, it's like, man, I need. I seen people stop and ask me about these shirts in the midst of a candlelight vigil where they mourning over their loved ones mm. because because of the statement, the the power right. that the statement has. Mm -hmm. And you gotta be you gotta be available for these people. And if the church is right next door from where murder is, and you not you not the pastor out here praying Ooh. over this candlelight vigil, you need to pick you need to pack that up and go because you're not you're not servicing your community. That's what and these churches often, are supposed to be for. And, and it's not often that you see those pastors out at those visuals. No. I can and I. That's, Go ahead. That's the concern. You got people like me if praying. Can, right. Like, where's the where's the leadership? If right. I can add something to it, because I've seen um, where people are passionate about whatever it is that that's for them to be passionate about. And in some cases, their perspective is that everybody should be doing the same thing that I'm doing. No. But there's a reason why we we have different purposes. And, and I'm bringing I'm not specifically saying that related to it, but I just want to bring it to remembrance. I've seen um, the differences where some people are working like w outreach i guess you would call it that yeah. some people are more in the communities whereas other people are there for when people are coming to the church yeah. you know what i'm saying so like i think there's a purpose for everybody's for ministry the right shots. just like you got yeah. evangelism some people don't it, do the that. different folds it, of the minute yeah it, and that's like like i try to explain to my pastor like if you you're not in full support of what i do still be in support that somebody's doing outreach because they want to know where i'm getting fed at and so I'm outreach for your church. I'm people. I'm right. I got people right. calling me talking about, can you come get me and take me to church, little homie? I got big right. homies that that's coming back right. off of their trips and they want to go. They want to go to God and they see God in me and, and you do what I do and they right. want to go through that. Exactly. Right. And the thing like, is, still cool. it, the thing right. is, you are a resource to so many people. It's not a matter of you being belonging to this church or that church exactly. or whatever. You're you're connecting people with resources, too. Mm -hmm. And I think there's a purpose for that. I do happen to see pastors that are out there that are involved in the community yeah. that are feeding people. But that but and I agree that it isn't always as common as it needs to be. Yeah. But I just give the benefit that, you know, maybe and, and there's let's be purpose clear. for everything. And let's be <laughs> clear we're not here church bashing or anything not like at all. that no. they that think i guess we is, is. and playing, they I'm think playing. that i do because because <laughs> i'm the one that's going to talk about it people like to sweep it under the rug and, and that's so, true what, what i Absolutely. like to do and what we do like, at like the organization risky. that i am we we yeah. are a pro we are we identify problems to seek solutions. That's exactly. good. And, if, and yeah. if we ignore a problem, how are we going to seek truth. that solution to that, that problem? That is true. Exactly. You're exactly. absolutely right. So um, you definitely some people don't know how it. to handle it, and that's why you need. we need brothers yeah. like you. We need brothers like who are willing to get out there and do something unorthodox for the church. Yeah. Because yeah. a lot of, you know what, ambulances go to go get people to bring them to the church. And if and sometimes flyers are the reason people come to the party. Right. Mm -hmm. yeah. We got to be those ambulances. And right. The, art, the artists got to understand that they music for for the movement. We in a spiritual warfare right Talk, now. Yeah. Yeah. And and if you're not speaking life into your community and you're not you're not servicing your community, you mm -hmm. just doing music and disappearing. Mm -hmm. And and then a lot of people, even with families, That's good. Yeah. sometimes because the word tells them people to. To leave your family behind when Jesus told them to leave their family behind and come the serve. Dead, the dead. You over there Let's and go. you you a valuable asset. Hold on, and, say that one more time. And so. sometimes, sometimes <laughs> the devil gives you a blessing and makes you be so highlighted on that blessing, not knowing that he's pulling you away from mm. your God given 
uh worth what you're supposed to be doing. Mm. Like for instance, I'm a journeyman in my trade. Oh, okay. And then they they tell me go to a, a oil refinery for 12, 12 hours straight. But the the key to it, I gotta leave my phone in the car. I can save so many lives even at work through a phone call. And now for twelve hours, I'm not I'm not reachable. I got a young I got a young dude with peer pressure that want to commit suicide that can't reach me. So those are the things where I had to pull back from my job and then right. through that blessing, I'm in the community and then he allowed me to get paid for doing something that I'm doing mm -hmm. for free. That's amazing. Yeah, you know, so that's go amazing. Ahead, go ahead. No, no. Are you, no, so no, you, so you are talking you, that real, ahead, man? Bro. I like go it. Ahead. Go ahead. So you in full time ministry? Um, I mean, ministry is, is is speaking life into your community, being a service of your community. We right. um. I, I do this nonprofit with Ceasefire, uh, Southern California Ceasefire. I work 24-7 around the clock with uh, mm -hmm. with the GRID program, and we service 14 to 24-year-olds on a whole nother level. We do community intervention. It's no longer gang intervention because we're going to get that troubled youth off the street, and we want to tap in. We got a system where we want to go. The case managers pass it. We pass it on to them, right. and they talk to the family because if we fix you and put you back in a broken home, then uh, you're going back out there. So, it's just like false rehabilitation. Sometimes exactly. what the jails do, you know what I'm saying? You get in the jail, they ain't really teaching you too much. You ain't getting no yeah. trades. You ain't taking no classes, so on and right. so forth. You get back out there to basically make the same mistakes. Yeah. I mean, I'm just basically a servant. I, I, I enjoy being out there and, and relevant to the people that, some people don't even know they need help until you just put it <laughs> oh, in their face. Oh, you better say that again. You know, so I'm out there being being mm -mm. being available for these people that That's don't deep. even understand that they need the help. That's deep. Until you start yes. putting it in their face, like my community didn't even understand we need a pocket park in the community. Exactly. We 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 need to shut down this block and do this big old block party that right. never happened, and it got the homies involved. Okay, He's go get the that. signature so we can uh so we can get the streets shut down. So now these people that have been sagging and. Banging on these streets. Now they knocking on doors doing something productive. Go now ahead, it's empowering ahead, them. Man. You know what I mean? So these are the type of things that you do. And it's empowering. just a small part That's good. of so many things that we Very need small. everybody involved. And the best part about it is you don't got to change. You just got to, you got to have an inner change. You don't have to have that outer change to pe mm. for people to see like yeah. that there's no outfit for somebody who believes in God. There's no like uniform for it. You, you know can wear saying? the same uniform, yeah. the same uh, uh, four days in a row. And see, well, a lot I mean, of times your people, uniform do got to change. You know what I mean, yeah. James? You, yeah, know you know what I'm saying? You know what I mean, James? Sometimes. But see, a lot of people think that they got to leave so much behind. <laughs> exactly. And if you, don't give, right them, if you don't give them nothing to replace it with mm -hmm. and good. know that you're, gonna be, you're not going to be stuck in a box and just hiding out. Like, yeah, yeah like definitely. Even, you you got to understand it's, it's something to replace that with, like rehab. Mm -hmm. Rehab is is some doing something productive with your time other than all that idle time. That's good. And people right, you know, running around here doing all this dope. And so like when we create peace, we just did that that thing where um, you know, gang game got highlighted and Snoop mm. with the peace thing, but it was a lot of uh people with license to operate in the community that yeah. made but that Pop thing. Trying go. To do that. Pop was trying to do that for a long yeah. time. But we've been doing that and then they chose job, however that happened, that happened. But mm -hmm. um what happened through that whole process even after the games and Snoops was gone, we created peace through jobs. That's and good. so the, the year to date, we we created that same form and we minimized all the Hollywood aspect of it. That's and we put a lot. You didn't see it on More the news. Real. So we put and the authentic the, the authenticity on it. Right. And so we we invited the community to come to um, get over 400 jobs. That's you amazing. Know, and so those and are the things, things like that, that we do out there. should be highlighted more and, and they should be supported more and, and more people can can support. You know, yeah. that's so. So if churches want to find out because you seem to have your, you, ha, you, you have basically your foot in the door of all of these different options, uh, op opportunities. How do they find you, man? How, how can we find rare breed? You know what I'm saying? What, oh. what do we what, what do we do? What do we type in on our little phones? Yeah, you hashtag rare breed three, three C and mm -hmm. everything pops up. Just rare breed three, three C hashtag that. Twitters, emails, everything pops up. Why, 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 I had a guess for what a 30, wanted, the, the, the 3-3-C yeah, was. I need to. I, I need I'm to thinking know. it's Christ and it's age. You know, that's that's how God worked. That's how that's how it happened. The Holy but, does it, it, but did it transpire from something else? It transpired from me um, coming home at that age gotcha. and being relevant to that C. See? That's nice. how things happen. So, oh, oh, I okay. 33 <laughs> this year, too. Hey, what was yeah. that? That was that energy. But uh, uh, can I say something? It was not energy. Go ahead. And it's crazy because... um. I was going to, when you said that's what Pac was trying to do, that's why I was raising my hand this whole time. Um, yeah, yeah, no, nah, but but Pac, I mean, in, even in the movie, and I knew this before the movie, that I feel like, this guy. y'all ready for this? Go for Are it. Are y'all ready for this? Go for it. Go ahead, Like you don't, said, don't, music don't throw had, off. No, no. <laughs> don't, don't throw, throw me off. off. Don't throw nobody me. can throw me off. So look. You throw um, yourself off all the time. <laughs> exactly. And nobody's perfect. 
But um, anyway, so what what I, what what you were saying was, <laughs> like people have to have a ministry through their music, right, right, and it doesn't have to be obvious um um Christian music. I, no, I feel it, no, it doesn't. It has to. It, no, it just has no. to have a message. Um, it just has to have a message. Um, I write Christian so called Christian music through listening to a pop album. Right, right. And right. This, and you this know, is I still thing. bang pop right now. I was gonna in, say, in, regard, in regards to what you just yeah, said, Pac I think that, that there can be a ministry in anything that anything. you do. And Go I think ahead, that's yeah. Ministry that is speaking about. truth. Speaking. Right, I mean, that's it. I mean, even I, if you it's not, not, it's not I, Bible I, study, it's not exactly. uh, quoting the scripture. Come on, and, man. And I'm, I'm really, I'm really like preach. irritated by people that want to just throw scriptures at me yeah. and they don't understand how I consecrated in the shoe program and I read my word and I went through my little ministry process to but, learn but, learn tools to better myself. I didn't learn the words so I could sit up but, there but, and mimic things in the in those pages. Do try not to get irritated by people that are trying to help, you know? And and just <laughs> Don't try to don't make, to help I mean, do work. I mean, we got wolves just, and sheep just, clothes. You know, I mean, too. everybody they, they, ain't they trying to help. Time, if they take the time right. to, to just, like you can, just like you can't pray, pray in a, everybody's yeah. circle and everybody right. can't pray right. over you, yeah. it, it's transfer right. of these spirits that that really taint us. And I've I've been in I've been in so many places where I have seen people just flip on you, like man, where that come from? Right. But if right. you're not if you're not on your toes, you are gonna let that bad spirit come and taint yeah. a good thing. All yeah. the time. Can I highlight the idea that he did say sometimes you don't have to be you know, shooting scripture at me. Yeah. But he's certified yeah. in his word. Not only you know that, what I'm but... Went in and, and got into it. He's definitely yeah. studied to show himself approved. Like, exactly. we get it that you need to know your word. That is God talking to you. But if I don't know how to do that, if I don't even know how to really get into that, I need to be able to speak to my brother in a real language that I can even get the taste of that. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? You know? You know? Okay, yeah. whatever. I do. No, no, I, I'm just, I do. I'm just, I'm, I'm hey, doing all clean up right brother. now. I just have, I mean? yeah. no, I, you didn't need cleaning up. I just have two things. Okay. One is you have people that would want to know that hashtag one more time. So can you repeat it? A uh, rare breed, you know, like the they say the motorcycle club and the rare eagle, rare breed, 33C. Three, 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 three. I'm not a yeah. <laughs> C as in. <laughs> hashtag That's his rare email. breed, 33C. <laughs> three, three, awesome. C as in cat, yeah. C as in ceasefire. Yeah, ceasefire. Okay, and then also I, I agree with the point that Icaris made, which is ministry does not have to, as you know, which is what you're asking, Tangelo. Talk it does not have to be an, uh, an obvious, okay, this is what happened. I ain't this asking, is, I'm telling. Right, but I like the fact that Icaris was... Um, Stating that it doesn't so have funny. to be a music, it doesn't have to be specifically this or specifically that. Man, music man, can be a, I mean, ministry can be a, a lot of man, things. Man, right. y'all yeah. don't understand. Pac was Pac was preaching. Pac was gonna be the next Malcolm X. You know what I'm saying? My, my older brother. He told was me evol that. He was evolving. He, I, I, he was evolved, I followed man. him. He was I, and like I said, I sat I sat in the in the midst of that whole little Pac era. You know, I was out here. We we was actually at the same hospital, and and somebody's mother was next door to him shot behind some stuff that right. you know that i had going on out in these streets and so just to be that that close to that whole Situation. era and, and watch yeah. it go down and feel it and you know that's the year 96 they said the year yeah. was going in and here it is Pac dead i'm i'm that's I'm crazy going i'm going to jail seemed like forever right you know two days is a life sentence when you're young it's hey. trying to and they, they force <laughs> you to sit still that's but crazy. um like you said, the the whole motivation of that album that I wrote, Lay My Burdens Down, was to encourage people to stop the stop, did that. stop dragging these burdens like a dirty shoe. You, yeah. you know, like a dirty tissue yeah. on your shoe. If You know, a lot of people go into church and get filled and say they're giving it to them. I sat in green rooms with brothers and we done prayed and, and fellowshiped. And then they still go up on stage with their chin and their chest. And like, man, we're like. I really, I really had to learn how to give it to God in that space that I was in, and then to come to this world where everybody's supposed to be encouraged by Christianity and this and that, and, and filled with the Holy Ghost, and and they just moping around here like you don't know the joy and the Defeated. goodness of God. I because ask you a question. I've been through. It. I want to ask you a question. Uh, um, do you regret going to jail and all that? Not at all. Because not at it, all because how you feel now. Right? It cre it it created who yeah. I am, and I and I and I, and actually what it did yeah. it it preserved me because. I was destructive and right. I was I was in a path of where I probably wouldn't be here today. Oh, I know. So definitely, yeah. definitely I'm excited about it and I learned that I learned that good and bad run in pairs. And if this was all bad, I had to be excited about the good coming at the end of this. So That's all I had good. to do was ride that wave out. That's and good. and this is all good. Being able to sit here with you, you guys and fellow fellowship and hopefully somebody hears something that's going to change their heart and they oh, mind they and, and definitely got to get up and do it it's not just me a lot of people say you 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 
I can't do it without the people behind me. That's Every, good. Everything is a group effort. Absolutely. I can't do this by Absolutely. myself. And for if real. we move by the masses, that's how change happens. Yo, Tangelo, every, every, if, for, for anyone that wants to call. Everybody's everybody. If anyone Everybody's wants to, everybody. Everybody's everybody. Go ahead. Go ahead. If Can any, you give them the numbers of people who want to call in? 702-608. Three two five nine. Y'all Say that one more it? time, Hold please. Hold on, wait a minute. You've been saying it for like a couple years now. Seven zero two. Do it for Wakanda. Six zero eight. <laughs> three two five nine. Yo, you are listening to the I Perspective podcast at, on Gorilla Cross Network. Yeah. We are in the building with special guests E. Carice. E. Carice. We also got Rare Breed, who Rare is Breed. an Let's amazing go. artist joining us for tonight. So we're excited. Yeah, um, and again, if you guys oh. want to call in. Oh yeah, and I was supposed to have a note. I have a nose ring because of pop. And I I don't have it in right now, but he's so, he's I just so want you to know that. Though. That's why you love him because he's so yeah. random. But I'm saying we was talking about Pac, and, and you know I, I love that Pac. was that was all the, that was your. Why you look like you sell you incense that. right now? Is what I want to know. I like. I, I I'm sorry, have, but Tangela, I, have I like your shirt. I love it. a lot. I don't. Yeah. I, don't. Yeah. I figured you. I'm would. here for the shirt, but huh? you're. But you don't care for it. I mean, no. I'm here she, for the shirt. She likes it. I like your shirt. You don't have to like it. Eight o'clock at night. If I didn't like it, I'd be like, shirt looks like. And Reverie, Reverie, we'd love for you to stick around and join us in some of the additional conversations. Yeah, like you said, you know, you never know who you're blessing by being here. Exactly. And Definitely. So, yeah. But once again, you, you can also, world, just so you know, you guys can find my man anywhere, just on any of your social media, hashtag RareBreed33C. RareBreed33C. Yes, sir. Hey, I and, turned 33 this hey, year. Do the, do the C stand for Crip? Be real. Oh be real. It, it did before Christ. See, I told you. Didn't he yeah. say I that already? Yeah, yeah. See, I, I didn't know that. You he didn't didn't know that. He's he late. Catch you know, I have a bad right ear and he on my right side. You know You got about? two ears on that. On the <laughs> but <headphone>. before <laughs> break, though. Yeah, go for it. Before break. <laughs> I, I want to leave y'all with this. And anybody else that wants to call in 702-608-3259. There you go. He agrees. Was Christ a crib? Was he a crip? You want to? Uh, was he a blood? That. Let's oh. unpack that. Hey, look, he shed his blood. Can we say this? Just... Look, look, hold on. I like when people look, say this, unpack. <laughs> hey, look, look, the blood. He a blood. The blood of Christ. The, the Holy no, Trinity. No. What? No. What? Oh, Lord. No, y'all don't. Y'all don't get that. <laughs> he called Lazarus out of the crib. I'm just saying. <laughs> Everybody got an interpretation. <laughs> <And> he's a <laughs> crip. <laughs> no, I just, hey, that that just came to me today, and that's crazy. How y'all. <laughs> Christ wasn't even a Christian. Yo, I want to get into another one of your songs. You're gonna take another quick Anyway, let's move on. But that doesn't mean that you gotta take that to your pastor first. Exactly. See, now, a real G. Now y'all, he definitely now, was now y'all a G. get it. You know, he he definitely was, was a G. No tables. little G. Now y'all I'm gonna we'll say this out loud, but you know he was out here with Mary Madeline and all that. Thank you. That's what I'm saying. I mean, I'm just that. saying I'm risky though. You guys are crazy. <laughs> you ain't no, more risky no, than me. No, that's just E. That's just E. You ain't more risky than me. <laughs> no, she, she's not the first person I've heard. No, he was. And there's a movie coming out. What's about that? about Jesus and uh, Mary. By who? Oh, yeah, oh. Da Vinci Code or some bull. Oh, Jesus. Oh, 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 anyway. That's, oh, that's your that's your perspective. That's it wasn't. Yes, hey, definitely her perspective. This is the odd perspective. <laughs> and, and my name is E. Carice. There you go. And my thoughts are risky. Exactly. Yeah. Please don't don't. I'm shut gonna be her on down. risky radio soon, huh? You should. Oh, I'm going. When, I'm gonna have when, all three of you on. When is it? You gotta pray for him when, <laughs> when he comes on the show. Radio. But can I get into this? We are gonna go into okay. another song. It's called Trading Testimonies. Let's go. Uh, my man Rare Breed is on it. You got my boy Purpose. Purpose for it. I guess the H Purpose. A stands for Hope Hop, right? Huh? What? H H M F. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hope Hop. Yeah. That's my boy, and we got Y A on it. And I don't know how to say this. Young other Young Anointed. Song. That's conscious. We got uh, Survivor Q who didn't make the video. They got some names. And on um, them. you know that that trading testimonies was actually coming came from Tupac's trading war stories. There you go. Yeah. That's bringing it full circle right now. We yeah. got <laughs> we got more Rare Breed on the other side. Y'all check it out. It's the I Perspective Podcast. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah, young anointed. No, you can't. You can't. Down 
for the king. For the king. Now, now I'm getting down for the king. For the king. Now I'm getting down for the king. For the king. Now, now I'm getting down for the king. Back in the day when I used to be sweet, when I on the creep with the heat, slanging dope in the streets. Yep, neighborhood banging, on the block slanging, liquor store parking lots is where I was hanging, selling crack to my blacks like a nine to five. I thought back then that was just a way to survive, but that was nothing but genocide. The devil he been alive, but thanks to God's grace, I got a whole new life. I went from glory to glory, now it's a whole new story. So when I think about my past, I laugh because it bores me. I can't believe that I gave that devil so much control and sacrifice my soul. And the streets paid in gold, but now lo and behold, I'm a born again Christian, made in the likeness of Christ, and saving souls is my mission. The devil never stop this, but I got my shield of faith. Yes, helmet of salvation, belt of truth on my way. I was addicted to crime, but he's renewing my mind. I was willing to change, now my life is the same. Turn my back on the world, I had to switch up my team. Now I'm getting down for the king. Now I'm getting down for the king. Now I'm getting down for the king. Down for the king, for the king. Now, now I'm getting down for the king. Dream about a blindness, every day it's combat. Never been enlisted, but swear I've been a high rap. The streets is where I died at, the church is where I lived up. Used to throw up gang signs, now Christ is who I live for. Never been a D-boy, but always kept a pistol. Now I keep a Bible on me, Psalms 23, folks. Used to be hard-headed, now I'm a little mid though. I feel like Beyonce, I had a big ego. Testimony, what I need to speak for. Boy, I keep in Jesus, I don't live by no G code. Never have respect for women, how I feel we slow. Till I got delivered, like I was shipped up by the key uh -huh. Hallelujah, thank you, Jesus. Got rid of all the demons. Romans 8-1, yeah, that's the word I need. Jesus, there is therefore now no combination. Best believe if it wasn't, I never would have made it. Before his coming, he had to die for it. Did my dirt and took my head. Even took up those nicks as I literally stuffed my pockets. Brought some world affliction, Lord knows I need a recovery, be in a crime at it. A nuisance condone the street static, coincided with an abusive weed habit, drugs traffic, put a bounty on my soul, thought I bought ultimatums of eternal hell for a heart froze, so ready with a will of change, recall when holy scriptures entered and tamed, flesh made me despair from a state of mind deranged, could run the over with God, grace and mercy happened before I understood essence of having life more abundantly, found it always has existed, through tribulations been gifted, no longer living to die, and my spirit stays lifted, to his humility just submitted, now things I see in my team full blown, we made in the war zone, with 21 eyes, this small council prepared to war with the world. And I'm really sick of crime, but he's renewing my mind. I was willing to change, now my life is the same. Turn my back on the world, I had to switch up my team. team. Now I'm getting down for the king. 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 Yo, that was Rare Breed with Trading Testimonies. Y'all give it up for that song, man. Y'all give yeah, it up yeah. for that song. Collaboration it. in the city. Con conscious? Yeah, that conscious. 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 His, his name used to be Sleep. So I'm he saying he opposite. got like a lot oh, more vibes. Oh, vibe. I like that. Yeah. It used to be, wait, well, I missed it. His, his name used to be Sleep, so he went opposite. Uh, okay, I w I'm with it. Stay yeah. woke. He could have just went Stay from woke. unconscious to conscious, but I'm with it. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? When you got a lot of letters, extra letters in your name, and you... Expecting everybody to know what it is. Yeah. It just sometimes James, you can't read. James, you can't read. <laughs> I can, but I want you to come over here. Yeah, and, I like the fellowship <laughs> with the music, so that's what that was. That's what's up, man. Yeah. Definitely. I like it. Whole Pop Music Family put it on. Um, that's the name right there. I'm, I'm just going to throw that out. What, Whole Pop Music Family? Whole Pop. Yeah, that's my boy. Yeah, Whole Pop. Like hip hop? Come on. My Whole Pop? Whole Pop. Hope. Hope. Oh, oh. Something he needs. Hope. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Not I need sure. hope. He Not need Ridley. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> You need real yeah. All right, let's go. All right, so, you know, as you guys know, you guys listen to this show, we get into, like, what kind of happened throughout the week. Yeah, what's going on? Over the last couple of weeks, or maybe I, I want to say just this week, this time, um, DJ Envy, you guys know DJ Envy from The Breakfast Club. Yeah, yeah, he cool people. He cool people. Um, he had the situation where he had two guests come in, uh, the Bodega Boys, Jesus and Meryl. They do a show on Viceland. And they came in, he basically kind of ambushed them. Oh. And I'll give, I'm giving you backstory pretty what? much what it DJ is. DJ Envy? Mm -hmm. DJ Envy ambushed them. Like when, they came, when they came into the show, he was like real, real like tight with them. Yeah. And he said basically that they they owed his wife, that he, they owed his wife an apology. Because these Zimero, who are kind of comics, that's all they do is just rag on everything. Right. You can find them on YouTube. You can find them on any of like, you right. know, that, uh, and obviously on Viceland. Uh -huh. They have a television show nightly. They just rag on certain things. And for those of you who don't know, that DJ Envy just recently got caught cheating on his wife. 
Oh. Just recently? This guy, he can't get it right. He can't. He he did it a long time ago. <laughs> yeah, it was he, a while he back. He had Tyrese come and try to exactly. sweep her off her feet. And, it and worked, that was all from that same thing. It. But that was, it was all from that same Listen, thing. When this, Tyrese... is, this is why you have open conversations with your partner. Exactly. True, true. Like, hey, this is how I'm feeling. This, right. is, what, this is what we need oh, to do. Oh, so right. try, you, you're trying to share. I'm, I'm just saying. <laughs> but look, I'm so... You're right about that. So when that situation with Tyrese came to count and men that whole situation, they basically joked about him being... Um, his wife being there for the check, okay? Because DJ Envy is a very highly known <laughs> wait, DJ. Wait, wait, you know how long they've been together? They have been, you and that's kind of, that was kind of his Ooh. point, right? Because when they came in, he was like, you owe my wife an apology, saying that she was there for the check. We done been together since we was 15 years old. Like, how dare you? And they kind of gave him the apology, but I got I, my question from that. that. Too, man. My, my, my question is, is like, if you're an automatic jokester, if you do this normally, what is too far with your friends. Mm. And then also, what's too far with strangers? Because... Where's the line? Yeah, because people were kind of, like, all in um, Envy's box, like, yeah, he was being real sensitive. Wait, wait, so are these, are, are these his friends? They know, they're, 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 they're in the vent, they're in the same media circuit. Right, um, but they're comedians, that's not, they're comedians, that's not though. like his boy. They 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 they, they, they stated like, that like yo this is my guy this is my guy they used the New York this is yeah, my guy people, stuff. Yeah, but people yeah yeah. yeah. <laughs> you, you you try your best not but to. But that's to, a good question. Go ahead, Britt. Yeah. So what's the um, <laughs> yeah, So what's the okay. like what's the it, line to so like it, play it, like don't play with my wife don't play with my kids like where's it, it, it depends if they're comedians right yeah this yeah. is all they do and obviously you guys know that I deal with comedians shout out to Funny Bones Live yeah you go dope. On Saturday, eight thirty p.m. Okay, uh, talk talk for anyway, radio voice. Um, you know that's so, Britney Frank. <laughs> <laughs> so I mean, these are comedians. They yeah. don't. It doesn't sound like that. They they have this true bond. Now, if they had a true bond, now yes, his wife is off limits. Right. right? That those are my thoughts. Ah. All right. What's if, your th- if, what, what do you think? What do you think, team? Thank you. Um. So <laughs> he was gonna get what, in there. What, yeah, what, yeah. what I what I think is you do your best not to. Uh, rub people the wrong way, and mm-hmm. and nobody's perfect. If you rub somebody the wrong way, mm-hmm. then you no, do you your but best. You just, you, oh, be y'all authentic, no, 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 be authentically yourself. Tia, no, James, y'all can you read? Can you ask y'all that question again? Way? No, Tiangelo. So James, what can is, you ask the question what again? What is too and then far? Again. What is too far with your friends, and then also with um like strangers? Like just, I know what is I was on my way. I know what I'm saying. I'm completely aware. I'm completely there. Uh, we're gonna so pray for him before don't you be leave scared. Every, so yeah. look to agree and i'll take <laughs> agree. all the prayer i'll take all that energy so look what i'm <laughs> saying agree. is if you have something to say if you if you if you're doing it out of uh if you if you're not doing it out of spite or, or you just doing it and and it, it makes you feel good then you do it and uh i mean you read situations of course but sometimes you don't you, nobody's perfect so if you do irritate somebody then, so then what's you the make, line you, though? Hold on, man. I just if, did you die? But did you die? If you do, <laughs> if you do irritate somebody, then you do your best to make it up to them. You do your best to show them that hey, I didn't mean to do, rub you the wrong way, and you just make sure they know that you didn't mean it. And if they don't point. take that, then okay. But you know at this point in the, in their in their in their DJ interaction, DJ and V saw for that because if they've been together that long, then it, it should be no reason why he should be insecure about so that. So you're relationship. saying that he should deal with the truth of the system and not he should have been like ah, he's, he's do stupid. There's like, a combination on, of things going on here, right? Mm-hmm. So obviously his wife is probably like, dude, I'm about to leave you. Exactly. Okay, right, right, so right. now he's sensitive. dealing with those emotions. Yeah. Now he has these 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 guys talking about mm-hmm. his his situation at and, home, right? And, where it could be still publicly, rocky, real, publicly, right? But actually, and, here's the thing, and just to interject, he went publicly. He he put himself out there on the radio on his own show. He put himself out there on the real. That's what he does. Yeah, so the yeah, thing yeah. is, is that like, okay, if you're doing this publicly, I feel like it's a public situation. He so has, can't be that's a good point. He, ha- he has to do it publicly. That's a good You think point. the wife made him do it? No. That's the no, lifestyle he, they live in, though. No, he it's made true. himself do it. But yeah. but listen, l- l- listen. But DJ he got Envy, tight over his wife, who is not necessarily a public person, even though she got like a couple thousand. Let's not get it wrong. DJ Envy is in a, he's in a tight spot right now. So it's a lot of people that wouldn't go about it the right way. You know what I'm saying? I'm not yeah. saying I would go about it the right way. So, I mean, we can't judge him too much on that. But in this situation, my opinion is, he he used to just look within. And, so was the guy wrong strong. or was Envy wrong? You now, said what? Nobody's if, wrong. If they real boys though, like if they 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 breaking bread together, right. mm-hmm. then they might have crossed the line. Exactly. But if if they in the same circuit and they they express themselves, they not they not out of pocket. Right. And it just to like understand that circuit. it just like they just in a media like circuit. Said, I know you from yeah, what we nah, do. Nah, yeah. they do what they do. They right. felt how they felt, right. and just because. They they saying through all them years now you at a point where you just here now for the money because all this stuff that transpired through the years you really not there for the love of it you know right, what I mean right, now right. you just spinning your wheels and say I'm just gonna right. hang out and for the wallet yeah yeah this is what I'm know? saying was was it a joke or was it a conversation it was clear I've seen the clip 
is clearly a joke. We'll play the clip. We'll play the clip, but not not tonight. We'll play the clip. You know what I'm saying? On our page. We probably. Yeah. yeah. That's one of those situations the truth hurts. Absolutely. Yeah, man. And and you just got to let it hurt. Exactly. And and that's probably what it was. It probably was rubbing him the wrong way because now he's already in this situation. And so for me, I got people that joke with me. That's my partners from Skates in the Crate that understand. And you can say certain things to me. But if an outsider say certain things to me, you it's don't on. get that pass. It's on. If you yeah. rub, if it rubs, if it, I say yeah. to DJ and V, if it rubs him the wrong way, then he look, needs to look within. So and what is the I just I think, don't know. That's I, I, and that's the thing about it. It's kind of like, uh, well, two two things I want to say. One is what I like, even when the Monique situation came up, mm-hmm. and some other people, uh, other people, when Kevin Hart is is presented with a question about it, he rep- I've watched him reply with. They're both really good friends of mine. I'm not going to say nothing but positive. I know you're trying to get something negative out of me, but I'm not going to do it. They're great, phenomenal people. And I think that is amazing. I'm not saying that everybody is that way. but I'm just not his friends. I I agree. You're talking about Kevin? They both verbally said, I just think that's really cool. I thought we was friends. I thought we was fun. And Envy said, I I thought we were too. I'm not assuming that they did have a tight relationship. Anybody can say that's my friend and don't. Go ahead, Brittany. It happens to us. Go ahead, Brittany. But but I'm just saying, you will need to go by history. But I think to get into the to get it to it's get the same, into the, it's the same thing industry is the same as local to get into the answer though what? to get into the answer of what you were asking i think if you are closer to those people you kind of do have a better idea of what's crossing the line yeah true. so Definitely. so that's when it hurts but when yeah. when you don't know and you're trying to get close to someone what what was it uh, uh tiffany haddish we just talked about her making comments about beyonce that beyonce didn't appreciate right. but she still got invited to the party now right. she do it again look, so then you it's brought a problem, up right? so you brought up kevin hart right and now the Breakfast Club was on Michael Blackston's head because Kev- he talk about everything. But this this is kind of like the same thing, right? Yep. So it's it's a it's not even a false equivalence here. You're talking about a comedian who went super hard. It looks like we got to speak uh, to me. We got a caller. <laughs> hold on one second. We got to You hold on, caller. Speak to me. Cuz I can't see you. Oh, I can't see. Hey. You. It's all good. Yeah, it's here. Yo, we got a caller in right now. What's going on? Where are you calling from? And what's your perspective? Hello, this is Peter from the block. Hey, what's up, oh, Peter? Peter went to the block? Peter, you know, Peter. I'm on the block. I, I'm actually not in the hallway. I'm on the block today. Corner cast, corner cast. He's in the hall. He's on I the can't block. hear him. He needs to grab the mic with the red cord. Okay. Uh, <laughs> uh, wow. Wow, Peter. Peter really knows a lot about our, our uh, studio, I'm, huh? Our setup. Uh, cor- cor- corner cast, huh? I'm an avid listener. Of the show, and I watch it on Facebook Live. Nice, man. Thanks, man. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. <laughs> yes. Uh, Wakanda what's Forever. Your, what's his perspective? Wakanda Forever, man. Yeah. What's your perspective? What's your perspective, sir? Yes, my perspective on DJ Envy is he's acting very, um, I'm not sure if I could say this as a white male in America, but he's, he's acting very light skinned and <laughs> very sensitive uh-oh, uh-oh. <laughs> in this situation. Hey, rare beans. Rare beans out here. Uh, <laughs> yes. He's light skinned as well, but he's not sensitive. That's right. Yeah, yeah, yeah that's it. right. That's right. He has a strong energy about him. Yeah, hey, we got know. some light skin out there making us look bad. We don't like- <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. They uh they put this term out beige rage that it was like it was this whole thing. So you think he was acting a little real, real light skinned, huh, Pete? He's super, super, super sensitive. So that's what light skin means? Uh oh. Is Go that ahead. what light skin means? No, it's not just what light skin means. Light skin we are means. so I, grateful for your perspective, I, Peter. I, I, I heard that. I heard that on another wow. show. So I just, I don't know. So As a white male, I, I was scared to say it anyway. So, so Peter from it. the hallway, what? How do you feel? What do you feel? Or excuse me, Peter from the block. We've we're changing yes. we're different area codes. Um, <laughs> what is your perspective? Do you feel like uh, people that are in the same industry as you, whether you're close or not close, that there is a line that they should? No, like, you know, don't hit below the belt type thing. If someone is close enough to you to know deep information regarding your relationships and drama, do you feel like they should kind of get off of it if y'all have went to a barbecue together once? Or like, what is your perspective about that? (laughs) Barbecue together. (laughs) I believe they didn't really go in on it that much. They said it as a joke real quick and kept on going. Yeah. So I, I, I I think they're comedians. And if you know they're comedians, you have to go with their comedy. And in addition to that, he did say, James mentioned he did say it publicly, right? On his show. So that's public records. You kind of put it out there. On a different interview. Yes, This he is did. true. Okay. The LP from the so block. It was, we it was out you. there. We appreciate your perspective, bro. Share the, share the page and um, keep listening. We appreciate it. And be it. careful yes, on and, that and block. Trump is doing a really great job in America. <laughs> <All right. laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> he said, "And Trump is doing a really great job in America. He about to get fired Goodbye, out here." Bye, Pete. <laughs> no, Pete gone. Pete gone. <laughs> hold on, hold on, hold on. I love uh, that guy, Pete, but, man. Pete's but I'm comedian. concerned about him saying that while on the block, though. I'm just concerned. Yeah, depending on what block he on. 
<laughs> he could be at the that's, gym. That's probably his last line. call. But look, so look, I got friends right now, and we harsh when it like this is my boys. We harsh, and it's really, really no line. Like even if you yeah. get mad in the conversation. There's we just no go line. harder. Oh, right. man, that's, but, that's, but that's, that's, that's a conversation between you. This is not your friends going this is public, a public about your But I feel like, it, I'll tell you right, if my friends was right here, yep. it would be a problem. Yeah. And we would, we would have to not air the show. Oh. <laughs> oh, so your friends ain't right here? One, yeah. Oh. You are, look, bro, you on time out. But look, we, <laughs> we're not going to do that right now. The burn. We're not going to do that right now. I thought but look, we were brothers. <laughs> I thought we were brothers. Brothers is not friends. But anyway, so really, the point that's, I'm trying to make false. is that it shouldn't really be that line if they stated that they were friends now if we're talking about people who just do comedy back to my man michael blackston who does comedy in the world everybody felt like michael blackston was completely wrong when he came at kevin hart when he had his situation out here in vegas mike don't do that because home is at stake so my question is is that does it does it matter mostly like now that it's the wife that it's the kids like home could be lost and you out here making jokes you supposed to be my guy and Michael Blackson and Kevin Hart got a history. They got a major history. Both came up in Philly. You know what I'm saying? Um, uh, Michael Blackson said the when he went to the when he went to the audition for Friday, Kevin Hart drove him to the airport. This is that they got history. And you coming at your boy foul like that on like like so is that is that okay? Is that fair? Because they're both comedians, should he understand it? They, Kevin Hart got his he yes. got his feelings hurt. And the thing is, is it is right. it okay for you to reply? And go like how they he waited to um Envy went waited to get him on the show to do that instead of sidebar mm, with him like some right, real G's right. dude. Envy's and, thing and, was they did it publicly, it. he Pu wanted to she, he wanted to shut it down publicly. Exactly. Right, I mean, but I mean is that okay is that okay too though? He should have know? addressed his own side. <sighs> you know, if he wanted to talk about it, say, Hey, you know what, this is how I feel about this and he kept it kept it moving. Right. But he could have went to yeah. these dudes like some, some That's men, not mature stuff. That's not that's not mature stuff. A lot of people say Envy was a lot of people so it's got people on both sides. It's prideful, you know what I mean? Yeah, stand up for your wife, you did your thing, and then also like really bro, like they comedians, really you talk about the thing is we all we obviously know they they likely don't even have a prenup, right? So he, he if, probably not. They probably don't even have a prenup. Yeah. So if she if she leaves, she she she's fine. So right? so, so okay. So is it okay so, to stay so for the, the back? So the Hold gesture on. that they're making, the That's comments the that they're making, is irrelevant. Yeah. All right. So so what what what? I lost it. Go ahead. <laughs> so is it okay to stay for the back? Like, is it okay if you've been there all that time? You you got to think about it. This is not just DJ Envy's career. Right, it's their career. Right. She's been there since he was fifteen, probably before he owned his first turntable. Yes, yeah, right. Before his first mixtape, it's their career. It's their money. And if she wants to stay, is it is it is it okay for people to 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 think like she's staying because it, DJ? She Envy, is not staying for the bag. I don't think I don't I don't believe she is too. Ah, uh, you think, think she is? I think I think I think it's a mix. I think it's a mix. She doesn't. I don't like, even know. Really, I don't even know the situation. She literally honestly, would get. But uh, if, the, if, the if, if in fact there is no prenup. Uh -huh. Because if they've been together for this time, time, this amount of time since he was fifteen, and then they grew up, and he started to get a little what's your name, and she said, "Do you want the prenup?" And she said, "Sure, I love no, you anyway." There's no way. I don't know. We don't know that. We don't know that to be the true. I, I'm probably ninety nine point nine percent. sure. That's fine, but that one percent <laughs> might just come in and be like, <laughs> Listen, oh, there's, "There's ink no on the line." line. There's no way. <laughs> But um, you know what? I'm staying for the what? prenup. So there, I'm I'm staying for the bag. How about that? You gonna stay? No, I'm not Put saying what I'm gonna do. a gold digger. I'm just, I'm <laughs> a just little kidding. gold digger. <laughs> the money. I mean, with what kind of shirts like knees. this? No, I'm just playing gold. With, with what kind of shirts like this? I would, I would stay. That's so not you're real gold. That's, that's not I, real no, gold. No, I'm not staying for the bag. I just <laughs> wanted to say something. I mean, at the at the end of the day, if they if she did want to leave, she would leave with a bag. Let's you know, let's just be honest. Either way, she would. Even if they did have a prenup. Up. Let's say hypothetically, it had to be. It had to be in the prenup, though. It, if, if, if likely, if he is caught with, with some infidelity, I don't know stars be having that that, that little clause. You know, listen, these worldly stars out here be having that clause not, like he, this is what. Listen, look, if I cheat, you can't. You ain't leaving with nothing. But listen, look, you know what I'm saying. Jay, Jay Z. <laughs> Jay Z was supposed to if if, if he got caught. That's cheating, That's a different wallet. You Beyonce listen, got a bigger wallet than him. Listen, if Jay Z got caught cheating, I uh -huh. think that he was supposed to give her five hundred million dollars. And Jesus if they had Christ. more than one child, he had to give her. This you is Jay I mean? or this like, Janet? Mind Remember you, Janet? Uh, Janet? Mind, you, too. mind you, he admitted to cheating. Yes, he did. And she's still he there. Had an album she doesn't it. need his bag, but she would have gotten it. That's All right. Crazy. So, is it good to stay through the school? It'd be a lot no, of little dudes. No, I mean, I'm not. I'm not here for a cheater. You're it's not there for it. Especially me, because you know my life. Right, you got this ain't love. You got over. Things, you got 20 years yeah. invested in your relationship. Cheating is a note is a deal breaker. 
so not okay, saying it's okay me, to cheat. I'm not. Okay. I'm not asking you that question. Talk about this. I'm huh? saying you put yourself in their position and saying this is our our stuff. Got to be bigger than this, or you know what? Nope, that is bigger so, than all everything we've gone through. So they're in a monogamous relationship. Definitely, you know, they're married. I'm not monogamous. They're married. Okay, so they're here in a monogamous relationship, and they are having. Um, and sh he has cheated on her several times. Who's this? It's not like uh, envy. Envy. He's cheated on her several times. Yeah, I, it, it's not it, like, I think it's going to come like out with just the one person. Maybe twice. No, no, I, no. He's admitted. No, he he he's always just, go on to breakfast or something and yeah, just. Uh, that's, that's what he's known. He's I just known thought it was just this one case no. with this one lady who I don't want to say her name is. But no, we no. What's her name, he, Jane? No, he got he got caught cheating. Oh, he even talked about it on a, on an interview that they had recently. Mm -hmm. I think they were on the real and they talked about it. That's the same. It's the same situation. No, this is this is from years and years ago. Mm-hmm. So and and then there's something that happened recently, ah. and and I don't know if you've seen a, a video of her recently. She was punching him in the face. Really, was she in the car? And some whomever was behind them caught them. Really, they out here boxing. Envy is out here. Don't, don't be I envious Reese, of that. I think Ika Reese be boxing too. Huh. No, I'm not a fight. I, hey. I, I do carry. I ain't got time to be fighting. You, you a lover? <laughs> you a fighter? You a lover, baby? <laughs> that sounds like you a, a lover. therapy moment, right? Yeah, there. I, I, I fight you from the distance. <laughs> I'm just I'm bang, bang bang. But uh, um, <laughs> all right. So Ikaris is not here for the bag. She's not here for the the no, the debauchery. Really. She's not here for the madness. I'm with it. No. Are you here for the bag, James? James is definitely a go digger. <laughs> I don't know. I've been with my wife He's since I was sure fifteen. Yeah. Sure I've been I've been with my wife since so, I was so you're 15 telling years, if, fifteen you, years you, old. Today, you got all serious. Today you go home. Hypothetically. Hypothetically. Today, today you Speaking go home. Of, mm -hmm. Don't do it. Don't Something say. Something happened. You find out your wife's cheating. Don't. Right. You got that right. OJ hypothetical. I'm, I'm right. Be, right. Well, I'm gonna be. Is this <laughs> risky gotta, radio? I'm gonna get into that. No, no, no. I'm gonna be super upset. What happens tomorrow? He gonna be super upset. He gonna, right, look, this is how this is how, this, <laughs> how picture, this is how I picture my marriage. The hood come out of him. Right, LA come out. My, let him my, talk. Let him talk. I picture my marriage like a room, right? It's this room. Just imagine this room that we in, and everything that we've ever gone through negative is a speck of dust. Oh, you we got an argument over this. It's a speck of dust. It's, our room is supposed to last forever. I love the way he. Yeah, you've explained this philosophy. Right. To so me it's before. supposed to be this. Now it's our choice to big to depend on how big cheating is. Is it as big as a couch? Is it as big as a chair? Is it a hole in the wall? Does it destroy the room? If it doesn't destroy the room, then I'm not I'm not leaving. That's Go when ahead, it goes biblical uh, what, where they so say it, it love covers a multiple. That's I'm, just saying, I'm just saying, like so, at the at the end of the day, you know what I'm saying? She slipped up. Or at the end of the day, I slipped up. Or at the end of the day, we messed up. We did damage to the room, but we did not destroy it. We did not destroy everything that we've built. You know what I'm saying? Like we we have children. I'm not saying the children the is a reason to stay, right. but it's like we we have history. Right, right. I, her family is my family. I'm right. talking about I've never not known her, but we started dating when I was 15. She was 14. We still together today. Right. And in those times, there's been there've been some cheating in our younger in our younger days, not in marriage. But I'm just saying, like there've been there've been some infidelities there. Am I supposed to just throw all of that away? I'm supposed to throw the future that we have. I'm supposed to throw how good that she can be for me and how beautiful, how, you know what I'm saying, how greatly I can make her smile and, and, and the cooking. Lord Jesus, I'm supposed to throw the cooking away? <laughs> hey, she, hey, she can cook he, now. He ain't stand for she the bag. He's stand for the cooking. Hey, hey, now, now, when, now, yeah. now, now, when you add a couple million dollars on this, oh, nah, there's no way. Like, So I'm just thinking, <laughs> I'm, putting them in, I'm putting Envy and his wife Gia in that situation. They're looking at it like they got five, maybe more kids on the way, you know what I'm saying, in, invested into. They got times, laughs, trips, you know what I'm saying, pictures they can look back and be like, look, we was our kids' age when we took these. We was younger than them. Like, that is something amazing to throw away just for what's your name. So, yeah, I do think it was a little foul implying that she was there for the bag. But I also think that maybe, you know what I'm saying, like my boy uh, my boy Peter from the Hoss Block said, <laughs> it was a little bit beige. She right. was a little bit But, right. but also right. understand how Hollywood has the – relationship yeah. developed yeah. into through the years because if he's so caught up in that Hollywood lifestyle, so mm. to speak, where he out there cheating and parlaying and doing all this with these girls, right. he caught up with that mindset mm -hmm. that I'm out here doing my thing and he, right. he loved the attention and he don't love the attention he getting at home to go home. Mm. So he's so, out there hey, some hitting Some wives sign up for that though. Exactly. So I mean, I'm not saying that she's husbands. one. I'm just saying that there are people who are out there who really don't that right. aren't there and, for the right reasons. That's, they're, they're that's, they're that's why I'm all about open open conversations. Oh, now, right. now, my last relationship, which it was a monogamous relationship, right? Gotcha. My last relationship, if something It wasn't happened, monogamous enough, you still ain't in it. I'm just playing. 
<laughs> no, it, it was. No, I'm just playing. Go ahead. I'm... But um, if I was in that relationship, Expl- explain to the people what Jesus monogamous means. What monogamous means? Nobody explain. needs to know. Is this real life? Nobody needs yeah. to know. We know what monogamous <laughs> well, well, means. That's not the word of the week, but I'll explain. <laughs> I, that I didn't later. know what it meant. I didn't exactly know what it meant. Right. But I just tried to. Uh, you need to sign more people. My bad. Sorry. Sorry. Had had my partner cheated, uh-huh. I probably would have considered, you know, okay, staying. Right. I like. I probably would have forgiven, considered something different. But at this point. Mm-hmm. Because I'm so open mm-hmm. about, you know, having open conversations about sure. our, our feelings and, and dating people and things like that. If my partner then still cheats instead of having these conversations first, right. then we got a problem. Then we got an issue. Right. That's yeah, real. And I that's think real. that, I, first of all, communication is definitely something that's going to keep relationships together. That's good. So you kind of like really just pinpoint it on, on that point right there. Like as long as we're talking about everything that happens, if something bad happens and you're willing to bring it to me, I don't find out from like three or four sources and so on and so forth, especially with them being in this open, uh, 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 just, just a limelight, right? Just because she is DJ Envy's wife, she has a couple... You know what I'm saying? Tens to tens of thousands of followers just because of that reason. Because they want to know that she's gonna she's gonna put up stuff that Envy won't. And they get mm. to maybe get in contact with him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. She got people going crazy in her DMs. Hey, what's going on with your man? What's going on with you? And guys is doing the same thing. <laughs> they're 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 blocking a whole bunch of stuff all the time. So they're out there. As long as they can sit there and communicate with each other yeah. and say, look, I messed up or I did something bad, or I was thinking about doing something bad, or look. They coming at me, but I, I got your back, boo, is and I'm with you. Is it That's what you want to you want to figure it out at the end of the day. Mm-hmm. I mean, is it, it's some, come, yeah, is it mendable? Are you right. are, do do you even have? Because he came out, he came out and said it, um, and it didn't seem like he he. I think he, I think he confessed at least in one of these moments because I didn't know about multiple moments, but he confessed about that it happened. So that's I mean, it's got to be some points. I'm so, not saying that it's okay to justify cheating. I'm just saying that he confessed, so he was he he felt open enough to his wife to say, look. He I had to up. be because he got caught. But one sometimes, more, one sometimes more, we I don't know if he got caught. Sometimes we confess confessed. one truth to cover a whole bunch of lies, uh, though, too. Yeah, so. Is this true? Because you know, his wife movie. was like, his wife, his, I remember in First the, um, of all, the you, event you're on very the very intelligent. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Right. That's an intelligent That's thing to say. In, the, um, <laughs> in, in the interview on The Real, his wife was like, she said, I didn't even know. I didn't even know. He was being so nice to me. He was being amazing to me. It wasn't like he was coming on his head down and, you know, the vibe or the... As, as Tiangelo would put it, the energy change. Energy. You know oh, what I'm saying? You I what? got something to say. <laughs> What'd you say? You always got something to say, but is it something? <laughs> <laughs> no, something I have, I, I, actually, I always have nothing to say and nothing is perfect. <laughs> Let's speak. Um, so I what? wanted to say uh, closure. How important is closure to everybody? Oh, it's very important yeah. to me. It's oh, very important to me. Closure well, I literally was just having di- this conversation it's with somebody. different, though. You said what? Uh, what is closure? Mean? A man's guys. closure and a woman's closure, it's, two different things. Right. What is what does closure Clo- mean to you? Guys? Closure to me is detail. <laughs> detail. What'd you do Not, before you say it? Closure to Brittany How long you been no there? Closure. Can I can I speak before you say it, Brit? Act like you're in a movie or something. Can like I that. speak? Jesus Christ! You hear me, Brittany? Before you say this, act like you're in a movie or something like that. When you say close, go ahead. What is closure to you? In a movie? Like yeah, a just, monologue? Like you go Brittany, in a movie. do you, please? Ahead, Don't do let you. him. I'm so do you. She got distracted. What's closure for you? What's closure? <laughs> we going to close okay. this conversation and go on to the word of the week. We're no, going to no, get no, into the word no. of the week. What is closure? What is okay. It? So, well, to me, closure yeah. is uh, getting closure and why it's important and whatever is like when two people need to sever a relationship or of any kind mm-hmm. and they can come to terms with it or they can have that last conversation. Sometimes it's a last conversation. Other times it's, Huh. You know, so you uh, need to get, we're you talking need about to see you specifically. A yeah. moment, I'm, I am. So, just, just, just anyway. speak. Just speak. I think she just, is. Just speak, so, Brittany. So it could be a last conversation. It could be uh, just an understanding or whatever. But it's like a, a point where you can acknowledge the fact that this is going to to this relationship is going to end. Now, let me be clear though. Closure doesn't always look the same. Sometimes closure is, is an it? abrupt it's... cutting off. Sometimes closure is a. Is it agreeable though? It's not always agreeable. However, as long as it's understand, understood, like acknowledged, so like isn't that this is the end. Hold on, hold no, on, James. Hold no, on. because if you if you have to get to the point, I have a stalker, for example, oh <laughs> and I've God. asked him repeatedly to stop contacting me. Is he me. listening to the show right now? I don't know, Brittany. Because every time I blo- views, but we don't want that Because every time I have blocked him on stuff, he finds something else to con- to you know. How, how is this? So it's not agreeable, but it's understood, and I did communicate. This is not okay. Like we're not going to be talking. So it, I got closure. <laughs> well, got closure. What, were, what were you going to say though? He. Oh my God! Be uh-huh. What is closure for you? Oh yeah, go ahead. You know, it, it, I agree with Brittany that it depends. It depends. Right? Okay. It depends. So there, there, for me, I could just be like, you know what? Mm, bye. 
So it's on. It's uh, only it's, you, especially if if it was based off of the behaviors of the other person, uh-huh. um, and, and, and they didn't have respect enough for me, then we're good. Right. Like, I, peace out. Give me a little more. Otherwise, if, if there's someone that you know, uh, maybe we had a uh, amicable breakup, mm-hmm. or we parted ways, whatever, whether whether it be friendship, relationships, whatever, family, you know. Yeah. Sometimes you got to let people go. Um, but you you know maybe we're like, hey, you know what? Maybe it's best that we just you know part ways. The and, friends and conversation. We, we should be friends. We, we understand that maybe we can revisit this in the future. Okay. But right now, it, you know. That's what I need this, to hear. This, so you got. This is how got, I feel about so it. You this is how you feel about notes. it. Nah, nah. I need I'm, to hear that. I'm not I'm really. Just, a hope. I'm saying you're giving hope. You're giving hope to them. Oh, so to me. So nice. You you right. break you don't just break hearts you just kind of like just, just string rip them, them along, a little bit just string them on, along a little bit no see what happens is I tell people what it is mm-hmm. and they don't want to listen to what it is and oh, that's where don't. it becomes confusing are oh, you a bag in yourself I'm what huh? it is I like to listen to they what it is they want to stay for the bag <laughs> I'm everything that is what what would be let's what go. would be your ideal closure yeah let's go or, or something that has happened to you that you know you said I got close from this she got close from this right every Everybody don't get closure though, you and know? that's um, right. It's true. Um, it's not like important. For, for, to everybody. Wow. On a personal level, I, speak, man. Speak. I'm, I'm divorced. Okay. And I'm divorced because I felt I was left for dead. Okay. And so that's something. She mama that's, that, you. that's something unforgivable, unforgivable for me. But Crazy. down the line, where you catch up and say I get it, it's too late for me because I already switched my mindset. Mm-hmm. I, I didn't took else. you off of that pedestal already. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? So mm-hmm. you want me to just reprogram but and you know they don't think that men um go through these emotional right, situations right. sure sure i'm like sure. i did i did a whole lot to get over this love right. thing you know what i mean you. damn and, it, and it's exhausting and it's draining and you like i don't want to do it again mm, right so crazy. that's deep so now you want to come back and get all this closure when when i wanted closure why, why you even did what you did and i wanted to work through it right so it, it's just it's and, different for everybody she, not only that, that but to touch on something you just said sometimes people show back up because they want to reopen it. It's not yeah. that they want closure. It's that they want to reopen and see what we could do, what we yeah. could work out. And you already are at that place. Yeah. But even for me, it's so but, important to me that if it means just having another conversation, that would be beneficial. I had one with a, a friend of mine. It took 10 years for him to open up about something. And when he did, I allowed him that. And honestly, it helped me because I didn't even know that I didn't have that some things weren't completely packed away when right. we had this conversation. But you know what? We don't have to have that conversation ever again. Okay. So if you it's got, like, what, hold on what, a second. What, hold on a second. If you guys want to call in and um, I see this. a lot of people on the live just chiming in. If you guys want to call in. It's <laughs> Please 702- call in. It's 702-608-3259. 702-608-3259. Call right, in. So on the closure, up. every circumstance is different. It's true. That, so that, that's where that what, comes what if, what if the woman? What, what if the woman is that that wants the closure is 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 beautiful in every way and and mm-hmm. she didn't do anything wrong you know what i'm saying mm-hmm. that's a good question okay so, so then what mean, do you what do is a hot question? mess what right. is, Go fix exactly. yourself. Go fix yourself. what is the question and, though that if if she's all these things yeah and she wants closure are you debating whether or not you're going to give her closure or you're just saying it's not you like don't he, said he was dumb it. enough to mess it up you don't want to <laughs> end it maybe 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 you don't want to give someone closure because you don't oh. want it to be over Oh. That's deep right there. Oh, that's yeah, that, that's that super R and B, but it's real deep. <laughs> he gonna write a you song. No, and that. it's true. Hey, you don't even know. <laughs> <laughs> and it's true. It's true. And to be it's honest with you, R&B. to be honest with you, Tiangelo, I don't know. E, what do you? How do you feel about that? Like, about what? if <laughs> the woman funny. is beautiful and amazing in every way, and they want closure, but you you don't want it to You'll end. Hear it. Um, you know what? Um, History, man. I'm always on that other side. You're always on the other I'm side. I'm always the one that's beautiful in every single oh, okay. way. Go ahead, stuff. girl. And the you other be person is girl. the one who's always messing, messing up. up. I've been meeting women I think you buy, I think like you've been that. biased right now. You perfect? Nah, nah, no, listen, listen. I've been meeting I, I women like that. I'm just, I'm just, I'm just, it's just, but I am pretty amazing. Pretty good in your, will, in your, in your relationships. I am pretty amazing. Look, I think, I think, um, I think, um, do you there's, think there's a lot of men that, 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 there's a lot of good men that, that do mess up and do make mistakes and, and i'm talking about bad mistakes dj envy mistakes you know what i'm saying and, and and it doesn't mean they're bad people and it doesn't mean that y'all women aren't as great as y'all believe that y'all are because y'all y'all are even greater than y'all believe that's not like a whole nother show right there it so. just it's just it's just um you know we're not perfect and we mess up and we in the wrong mindset and sometimes it takes a uh, heartbreak 
to become Super Saiyan. Nah, it sometimes it takes heartbreak. Yeah, I have to do it. It sometimes takes heartbreak to 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 you know to wake you up. Righteous. So I, at at the end of the day, you don't have to have a, an official closure. Um, it's really it happens at different times for people. Yeah. Yeah. Um, if you messed up and you want closure or you don't want to give closure, is that being fair or is That's, it being unfair? I've gotten it years me. later. Uh, it's it selfish. Is, absolutely not. It's definitely selfish. selfish. It's selfish to me, but <laughs> to but but, closure, but not every situation re- closure looks different. Closure may look right. like look. We've announced it's that. a wrap, yeah. and that's and and it's understood. So whether people feel how they feel or not, you don't have to have ongoing but conversations. See, I, I feel like that's closure. Hearts. Why? Because you said that's it. That's the point exactly. I'm making. But that's the point I'm making. It, that closure closure like if means you're just not different talking, things. Yeah. And if, if you're just not talking. All right, can you can you get closure through a text? Can you get a yeah, divorce yeah, through yeah. a text? You can get closure, can you? closure through every single really avenue. That you some can. are better yeah. than others, and some are may, selfish. May, and get, I'm gonna I'm I'm say this: can, can you get, can get close? The, pro- boom, boom, the problem boom, boom, is, boom. is that put your phone closure, down. Closure should be for yourself, okay. right? If if I am in a situation with someone mm-hmm. and I don't desire agree. to have a this long drawn out conversation with them mm-hmm. because I am I have already disconnected from the situation. I'm done with it. There's no need for me to have so sometimes you conversation. Got, sometimes you gotta force yourself have, into You have closure. to protect I yourself. Have to, right, and I don't have to, just because this other person wants to have all this closure in these yeah. conversations, got you. that doesn't mean that that's necessary for me. That's true. true. And, and if you're thinking about yourself, close, close, yeah, yeah. if you're, you're only you thinking about people, yourself. You shouldn't have to walk people through their It's just, breathing just all I'm saying moment. is. Yeah. And be mindful that it's a, it's a form of immaturity that stopped people from being together, so that's where you can't have that closure because it was an immature act. I, that absolutely, that happened. true. So, I just want to say ahead, though, Pat. I I can name probably fifteen relationships that ended in whatever capacity where one person felt, um, I Is don't have to give no, I don't have to give closure, or I'm I'm good, or whatever, or they're they're deliberately denying that last conversation. If if they're you know that other person felt that there should be I don't one. think they have to and like then it, but later they, on yeah. in life them same people regret not having that conversation right but it's, that's but I that, can name like time after time I'm not saying but you that everybody the moment. that's your moment yeah so you if, can be selfish moment, there's nothing wrong with it's that not, that doesn't that's not selfish I say I, I say, I say this I chase Maybe closure on one situation and I ask questions I wish I never had the answers to Say it again. I'm sorry. I I chased closure on one situation, and I was asking questions just out of emotion. Right. And it's it's if questions you, that should never been asked or answered. Right. I mean, to know, be honest so. with you, it every everything's different. But people that are good at cut, people that claim, oh my cutoff game's so good, they be this. Th- those often are the most miserable people when it comes to relationships because your cutoff game's so I, good, I you think, don't know how to communicate to people. That's all I I'm don't saying. know. I, I don't agree with that. We disagree, boo. Yeah, I don't. I don't. I don't <laughs> and it's don't okay to disagree. And it's okay to disagree. It's all right. Yeah. That, that's I, what you're supposed to do. I mean, I do. think that people. I think that people re- react on their own time. That's you know, true. sometimes you may not want to have these. There's nothing wrong with that. Or whatever. Yeah, because when, when, when when there is a breakup or when there is a, a decision, a firm decision being made in a um, in a relationship. One person comes to that decision before the other. It's uh, not usually like a amical, like immediately. Right. Oh, we did. And it's, All right, it's and over. This is the thing with me. With me, ninety percent of my relationships, you I am still off. no. I'm, I am. I am very good friends I'm with them. This we we break up, and like I I have a I have a, a ex boyfriend um, that he just recently asked me like, hey, we should have a baby together. Like nice. that—that's just the type of relationships that I end up, you know, I end up having. That sounds like something you make in college. Like, look, if in twenty years, ah, uh, we're I not think, I think the biggest we thing out of it all. You see, you see, exactly. You see, you see, yeah. You, you, see, see, you got to get the growing pain out of it, and you got to grow from that pain. Yeah. Yes. And if you're not growing from that pain, because a lot of people stay stuck in that pain, yeah. And you see them down the line, like, man, what happened to you? And they drug themselves through that pain, right? And they never, they never accepted it and received it. For the growth process, you know. That's right. True thing. Right. I mean, learn from every experience that you're in. So we've talked a lot. Of, we talk to people a lot. Yeah. Um. And and we've taught people how to deal with closure, how to yeah. joke with your friends. Yeah. <laughs> taught a lot about rare breed. Yeah. Taught yeah, a lot about his right. ministry. Yeah. But there's one thing we got to always do when we teach in here at the uh, Perspective Podcast. Energy. It's not about energy. Oh. And it's not monogamy, but we'll get into that. Yeah, and if if you don't know what monogamy means, brother, he doesn't. So he got a clearly phone, Google <laughs> based yeah. off of his comments. Today. No, I said, I said I said I said some people mean. Oh, I got you. Oh, okay. I some people. I think. Oh, yeah, I got a Come friend. on, guys, yeah. get it so, together. But but what we do, let's bring it in. We do 
like to teach on this uh, show. We do like to teach. We do. So I think it's time for the word of the week, bro. I think yeah, yeah. I'm ready. Are you y'all ready? are y'all ready? So you get, ready. you get to guess what the word of the week sounds I think he'll like. Get it. I he think might he'll get it. He might know what it sounds like no. for real though. You, you <laughs> ready for this? You can guess. You it are. doesn't matter what you say. First of all, I, I think you've already stated that right? he's a genius. I think you need to I not said try he's to because very intelligent. So let's get into this. Let's get into this. Okay. Well, check this out. though. First of all, you're throwing too many big words at me. Okay. Now because I don't understand them, I'm gonna take them as disrespect. Watch your mouth. Watch. What is the meaning of this? Education means you will learn to speak in a new language. You're gonna learn today. You'll be taught to achieve insight into the world around you. The word this week is. The word this week is excoriate. Ta easy. It is a verb. Excoriate. Of easy. Course. I need everybody's participation. I got it. And we will be using points, so. That's okay. D'Angelo, you wanna go first? Not first, though. I thought I got it, though. Excoriate? Excoriate. James Mason. James always music. goes first. He's what yeah, is it? I'll go first because it's such easy words. To That's, what That's what I'm saying. Clearly. Clearly. Excoriate? Yes, it's a verb. Okay, got it. All right, so look, we've been talking a lot about relationships, right? Yeah, we have. Yep. Right. Come on, James. Right. Come on, James. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I already so, know. Come on. You guys remember that movie, Love and Basketball? Love and Basketball. You, boy. Somehow we went. <laughs> boy. To love you, you, you remember that movie? Oh, yes, you know. Yes. Uh, of course, you remember, remember, hey, remember what radio? Yeah, yeah. Remember what radio says exactly. you Exactly, you right there, Britt. Exactly, you right Play there. Play for your heart. So, remember when they was playing for each other's heart? At the time, they was exes. Yep. Mm. And they had to score. Yep. On each other, <laughs> they had to score on each other, just so they could um. <laughs> Let's get it. Just so they can like win each other's heart. Yeah. Right. Yeah, yeah. So, when she scored a seven, he a scored eight. And so his her excoriate. You know what I'm saying? Okay. Okay. So I like you, that. You use it in a sentence. I like that. And do we have a call? Oh my God. Do I we can't have believe a that my ex is scoriate right there in front of me. And I just be one. That is that is one of the definitions. Going to eight. And I, I shall What go is now. it? What is okay, and then and we're gonna get into E and yeah, Rare yeah, Reed. Yeah, so what is the what is the second definition? So the second definition. Y'all don't gotta push her, y'all genius. Which may be the first. Uh uh, <laughs> uh just like he said, X. Right. Um, <laughs> of course, I know what's up with that right now. Um, X. Oh. And then you trying to, you trying to, you you know, if it, it, it's your ex, then you trying to score again. You know what I'm saying? You're trying to score again. Oh, you talking about closure? Come on now. You trying? No, 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 <laughs> not closure. I, I guess you could call it that. Mm -hmm. But you trying to score, and then uh, she ain't opener. really with it, so you had. I ain't gonna finish it. Eight. But, yeah, I knew you that's, were all, that's all we do. Yeah, Willy Wonka, for, that's all we do. Pray for T. Angela, please. Okay. Yeah. Okay, all right, then. so Icarus, come on, tell do us. You guys want to attend? You, Take a guess. You don't have to let her I mean, know I'm, that you're a genius is, as much as you are. I mean, but I am. I, yeah, yeah, go ahead. Do, then tell her. Go ahead. So I'm gonna go with. I'm gonna go with this, and and I think I'm pretty sure this is the exact definition. Right, okay. right, right. So, right. um, I, oh, X obviously. Exactly. Come on, we all know that. We all know that. Go ahead. Exactly. Real rap of Extra. Okay. Uh huh. Okay. So, um. Uh huh. See what happens is is that you go out, okay, right? yeah, and and then you, you remember like you you kind of go back to it, right, right, mm, and, right. and then you mm -hmm. you get points, you tally up. I'm right there with you. Oh, I'm okay. right there with you. You tally up, uh huh, because every time I go out and eat, mm -hmm. ooh, <laughs> come on, who you now. eat with? Every every time, so you got listen, the bag. With. Every time come I go out and eat, uh -huh. I score uh -huh. points for my stomach. So go I ahead, ask, excoriate. Eight. Ah, exactly. Those points. All right now. All Bars. right now. That's a good one. All right now. E. All right now. E. Let's go, no, Rare You got to participate. You don't have, you don't have, look, I'm telling you. you don't I can't, have, can I get a derivative, though? Like, like where did you derive from? Is it a noun? Is it a, I it's would a like you to participate. We know it's a verb. Just verb. That's why I said it's It doesn't even matter. Just make it. We we got all the definitions. Can y'all let Rare Breed tell us what it is in real life? Real life, man. Just say it. We're going to make believe because this word right here, is, <laughs> I never heard it. I never read right. it. I never go seen ahead, it. Go ahead, go ahead. In a minute, she's going to tell you what she think it means. Go yeah, ahead. Right. Try, okay. try, try, try. What do you feel it means? You know what I'm saying? Let your energy Was it go, X or brother. S? X. X. Yeah. yeah. We got a caller trying to chime in? I don't know. I don't know. You're saved by the caller? Caller, yeah. hold on real let, quick. Let them be saved by ask, the caller. Ask if they're trying For to sure. chime in. Hold on. Go right ahead, brother. X or E8, man. Let your energy flow. Man, like we've been dealing with the X's, right? Right, right, right. Yeah, yeah. And talk then, it out, talk it out. And then I think we're dealing with the core. The Yo, core. You know, I like that. Okay, see, okay. See, yeah, decorations. Yeah, yeah, let, him core, let him talk. Decorations of the X. Okay. Let, let him yeah. talk. Yes. And the E8 part, right? Okay, uh -huh. the E8. Uh, 
that's just like it's it's so lost in my mind. We just gonna just claim that it's a lost thing. Okay, uh -huh. you know what I mean. Uh -huh. So all right, yeah, that's mm. it. EA Sports yeah. score. Let's see what I this see lost going. core. Hold on one second. <laughs> lost cause. Hold on lost one second. Right, right, right. Yo, right. caller, 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 you there? Yeah, What's that. your perspective? Do you know what excoriate means? Of the word of the week? Is that what you're calling for? No, I was calling about the closure thing, like the whole. All right, hold all right. On. Well, give me, I was give us. Get in on the closure. So give us one second. We'll be right back to you. I hit a soft spot on the men. <laughs> <laughs> so, Brittany, you want to just let I was people hoping know so. what you think excoriate yes. means, please? I'm gonna go with TT Google. Mm, she thinks she knows everything. TT she Google. does. She and it's on the internet, so it must be true. Um, excoriate <laughs> is a verb, and uh, it means to censure or criticize severely. Oh my God, is that wait? So, for example. <laughs> The wait, hold on. Wait is a minute. Not what I wait just a said? minute. Wait a minute. Go clearly, back. Go back. Clearly. Go back. Go back. That's what you <laughs> That's guys exactly said. That's exactly what I was saying. Okay. Exactly. So, so because when they was playing basketball, they was obviously criticizing each other's game. Exactly. That's right. Exactly. You're right. It was like, oh, you didn't, you didn't do that. You didn't do that crossover like you should have. And that's Three what some exes do. Not, not, right. not everybody. But, right. You know. Right. Censure or create or criticize severely. The papers that had been excoriating him were now lauding him. The other definition is. Is that from the Bible right there? No. <laughs> the papers had, that had just. That's that. from politics. Hey, man. Uh, the second one. <laughs> All I know is I'm right. Yeah, that's a The second word. one is damage or remove part of the surface. So, for example, the skin. Mm. And I so, think Tiangelo yeah. said that. I think he said that. Mm. No, I think X core. <laughs> no, he did. Like the core, yeah. you know, you peel the apple core. Exactly. Right? Yeah. Yes. And then with what yes. he was saying, too. Because you feed you, the core, yeah, she, she, you feed she, she, she had to clear the, that surface of, the, of her food. You ain't gonna Absolutely. give me no points, Brett. So for everybody, yes. you give without the PA. Give me some points, Brett. Everybody you gave gets, everybody points. Everybody gets half a point. Cool, cool. That was Brittany's okay. word of the week. Everybody, you welcome. There we go. You're welcome. I love You're it. You're welcome. <laughs> you we, guys always, are crazy. We, we always, Watch we always, we always teach. What? You know what I'm saying? So we always out here getting it in for the people, They're just giving you a couple everybody. of knowledge. But let's get to this caller real quick. Caller, <laughs> how are you doing? Where are you calling from, and what is your perspective? Oh, yeah, me. Um, yep. yep. I wanted to call. What's your Hold What's on. your take on closure, brother? What's his name? Oh, this is my take on the closure thing. Um, I think that closure is for both individuals. Okay. Especially due to the fact that you may want to not have that relationship or that that bond with that person. Uh huh. But you also need for those that other individual to know that this is over. Right. So you can't personalize it and just act like it's just for you. Like I had a particular relationship while I was out of state mm -hmm. with a woman, and I knew that once I had a chance to talk to her, even though we were in different states, that I needed closure. Are you, now, now, are you driving out of that state right now? Knew, we, <laughs> I'm just huh? go, go, now go right ahead, brother. <laughs> I am out of that state right now. <laughs> it's like you seem like you're driving, like but it's I'll the getaway. Back in a bit. The state line right now. <laughs> Sound like you're trying to give her nah, give her a closure I'm here in California. Show. I was in Vegas, <laughs> but um, I knew already that I needed closure in this situation because if I didn't close it, not just for me but for her too, then I'm gonna get those calls from her. Mm. Like if everything's still good, and then shit's not good no more. Like right. excuse my French. <laughs> hey man, hey, hey speak, no speak so your French. truth and, okay, and what you feel, brother. But yeah, so I'm just saying, like, I agree with you guys and what you guys were saying as far as like, oh, certain people don't feel they need closure, and other individuals feel like they do. Uh, some individuals feel like it needs to be a talk where you sit down, you hug it out, or whatever it is. And uh, James, I, I think James mentioned something about a text. As long as <laughs> there's a That's definite. Terrible. Like, look, this is it's the cutoff. Yes. You know, this is what I'm not going to do, and, 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 and this is what the, 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 what the deal is. Like, that has to happen. Yeah. Well, brother, Whether get it's it. for you and you take it personal or it's for the both of y'all like it should be because they need to know, just like you need yes. to know, that it's, it's a wrap. Yeah. Well, well yeah. get the people your name, man. Where are you calling from again? Oh, I'm, I'm, my name is Shane. I'm calling from... Right now I'm in Burbank. Also, I'm calling from Burbank, California. Hey, from the hey, getaway I car. went to Burbank Middle School. <laughs> well, thank you, not Shane. I yeah. appreciate it, man. Not in, no, not in Burbank, though. <laughs> he said they got middle schools out here. <laughs> thank you not for your perspective, man, and keep listening to the show. Share it as much as you can, Pace. You're right. Yep. Sure, Highland Park. Sure, Yo, so apparently he was in the getaway car. Yeah, yeah. yeah he, he just robbed the getaway away from plan. closure, and he used car. us as the closure uh, <laughs> conduit. Right, right. I think... I was on the phone with the opposite perspective. It wasn't me. You I've, didn't been, hear. I've been in all the situations where you sit down and can talk it out. Yeah, and then other those times, people you gotta 
just walk it out. You yeah, know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. But right, you, because they keep, on, sometimes yeah. they keep on trying well, to when be you, more Well, you know that they're trying to dig and go somewhere with it yeah. and think that the closure is going to yeah. bring you back closer. I, I, yeah. Sometimes they think that closure. I'm, there, it's manipulative. I mean, at the end of the day, sometimes they don't even know their motives, but they just yeah. know that they, they hate the fact that they have to disconnect with but you. But then you got that um, misinterpretation so that that's when you sit you down that closure, be like, well, uh, this would happen and this why it happened. Yeah. But, but, and then so, you could say... What if, <laughs> My bad. I don't mean to touch nobody. We're not reuniting. <laughs> We're not reuniting. But but just having uh, that, like I said, that the the situation that I um spoke of, the person um ten years later, ten years later, finally opened up about some stuff, and I didn't even know that he was withholding. And he was like, "I've always viewed us as Tupac and Jada." Like I've never. Crazy how so so Tupac closure. A lot. So closure for That's the weird. people that 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 are too adamant and too. Persistent, it, you just say closures. Look, I'm done. I don't want it no more. Yeah. Hey, hey, so for those and people that don't understand right, that, and that, if out. they say they walked away, they gone. If and they're what, not what, calling you no more, I just stop calling and you them have them. to sometimes. Yeah, yeah. I agree. Yeah. To I agree. Like, Again, closure looks different. Closure looks different in different situations, and sometimes yeah. people just need that block. But, I, but but to be fair, <laughs> why is that funny? Yeah. Hey, hey, Brittany, I believe. I but believe, I was just gonna say I that. In that I was. Yeah, I was just gonna say that right I just don't respect, and this is Britney's Britney Soul's eye perspective. Go, right go ahead, girl. You better say that. Say I don't respect time. people that say my cutoff game's so good that you can take months of getting to know someone to try to get to know them more to develop a friendship or a relationship. Yeah, but when it's time for me to fall back because your energy felt weird or whatever the reason is, you your are, cut you off game so now, good. Brett. But, but we live in, we live so in a superficial world, uh -huh. you know, stuck with false perception. Yeah, yeah, that's, that's the majority right now. So wow. when you but understand the root so cause quickly, of it, then you know yes. how to deal with it. And that's the thing. Just be authentic. And like I said, be clear. Be be consistent. Be mm -hmm. clear. Be have that understanding. But I feel like at some point there should be an understanding. You don't just disappear and not talk to somebody. But no. But if somebody <laughs> says to you, "This is a wrap. This is it. It's been good. That's, that's, I, that's, they hit you that. with the Michael Jackson then, album. Then, this is it. If the other person and that's so fine. If the other person can't take in that this person just said, "Hey, do y'all uh, do y'all want to hear a song? I mean, no, no." <laughs> No, yeah, no. yeah, we do, Tiangela. Okay. Just maybe later. I love you, Carice. I'm just kidding. You <laughs> love her? You love Did her Did she say now? no to? Yeah. I love everybody in here, man. Oh, I heard okay. the song. It's fire. But we don't want to hear it right now. It's All coming right. out on the 32nd of the month. It's coming. Yeah, we got, we, thir on the 33rd. On the 33rd. On the 33rd. Oh, yeah. uh, I mean. Uh, but, but no, we definitely going to. It's gonna like hear. the person that called your phone. Like, y'all ever had somebody who's like, stop calling. I want to talk oh, to you. Yep. I don't have goodness. to. What you mean? It's my number. You, I don't want you to. But, but, but I, you I will say this. Them, you done renamed yeah. them as Don't Answer. Right? Oh, my God. Hold on. Real quick. Real quick. I will. I will. Go ahead, Gary. Nope. How you going to say real key, real quick, and then just hand it off? No, I'm saying maybe, maybe sometimes you, you, you don't talk like an NFL quarterback. Go ahead, like, go right, ahead, Angelo the angel. Um, sometimes it's crazy that you said that. Um, sometimes uh, people uh, don't want to talk because they don't want to give closure because they they want to just become a better person before they even talk to that that person. Oh, uh, okay. So you holding you holding, you love holding hostage. on. You holding but, love hostage. But some people I need say air. I was doing that. So that's, that's what it sound like. You need air. Like if I'm. If I'm mad at that situation and I can't deal with it right now, communicate that, that right? Space. Openness, right? <laughs> but no, when you say, "Hey, I'm good right now," that's they pressing oh on you like, that. "Oh my god, say, you say, look, don't want you that. communicate. Oh I need, I need time. I in. need time to process Listen. this. I need time to deal exactly. with it. Right, so, you need to see if you want to be right, in so it one, once as again, well. All right, last perspectives on uh, on, on closure because we're about to close out the show. Go ahead and share yours first. I don't. I just, I just said. I just feel like as long as it's said, then closure can begin. Okay. Obviously, you get closure when you get it. You'll get it at three three weeks later. You'll get it when you meet someone new. You'll get it Whenever. when oh oh this is it. Okay, got it. At their funeral. But somebody came to closure <laughs> first. Sometimes <laughs> you get at the funeral. <laughs> So we really ain't gonna be together. You just gonna die on me. You just gonna die on me. Wake up and tell me. No Monday, chance. <laughs> you no, you no, you coming with me. Come on. But come at the on, end right. of the day, somebody came to closure first, and somebody is gonna get there whenever they get there. Yeah. yeah. And I you may go shout out to people that you may go it. in and out of it, but you know what I'm saying. It's, it, 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 I, I, we, I think we all agree that it is fair that all parties get closure, no matter how you get it. Yeah, it could be. Oh well, dang, they they stopped talking to me, and that's it is what it is, and that it comes in different forms. Definitely, I will say this. Um, I knew we were going to talk a lot about energy and closure today because you brought it up, bro. Definitely, no, no, yeah, I think you I did. did. I think you I did. did not. So, um, did. one last Maybe time, one last time, can you tell the people, Rare Bree, where to find you? Uh, hashtag rare breed 33C 
Hashtag Rare Breed Thirty Three Six, and that's anywhere. You can just hashtag anywhere them on, on, on that's, Facebook. That's the get... new. That's the new way to track people. You don't get a hundred million names. You get a hashtag, hashtag, and you Google that person, yep. and everything pops up. Right, that's, right, right, that's true. Right, right, right. I'm always He's schooling searching us ha- over hashtag. here. Brittany Soul, where can people find you? At BrittanySoul.com. Definitely. Hey, Miss. E- <laughs> that's your tag. Hey. I got a thirst. I like. Hey, I like that. Do, do anybody else do that? I ain't never heard nobody do it. I get other hey, people to do, do it. Do it all the time. Okay. Do no, it all the time. Please, trademark that. Please and don't. be great. I don't know about trademark. Be great. Please, please don't. Michael Jackson Something did. Like. <laughs> you do that. Hey. All right, go ahead. <laughs> do, it in, do it in your song. See what happens. Go ahead. Okay. Listen, you can find me on every single social media platform at E Carice. Okay. That's E C A R R I C E. You can also catch me live there you go. on www.hot7025fm.com. We are going live April 1st. Man, it's about to be crazy. I, I appreciate know. you guys. We gotta have you guys on Risky Radio. I yeah. can't wait to come. And I've seen, I've seen, I like peeped into the studio yeah. too. Ikari's so guys yeah. some stuff over there. Yeah. So I'm really happy about that. Thanks. Ikari's owns her own studio. Thank you. And if Let's you guys go. want to come in or you want to call in, she'll have all of her information. What's the day you guys are launching again? Uh, we're gonna we're gonna go live April first. April first. So it's not a fo- that's not April Fool's joke, right? <laughs> no, Don't just come up on the second like. Gotcha. Oh. <laughs> Got hey, y'all thought we was gonna hey, go live. We don't know. We don't know what can happen. <laughs> we you just exist. <laughs> but that was deep. <laughs> That's Nobody funny. caught it. Tangela, where can the people find you? Um, you, you, why are you so? How you? Why are you so professional? Why? Jesus Christ! Yeah. Are you hitting on? You, you, can, you can you can meet me at seven oh two and then you can reach and we hot. <laughs> she flirtatious though, huh? For real. You're so nah, funny. No, I just want to be as professional. So where can so the people find you? So one day I will you? be. You know what I'm saying? Huh? So where can, be professional and tell the people where they can find you? <laughs> um, well, you guys obviously know I'm sponsored by Instagram, yes, and Facebook. You, are. you know I'm moving on up. I think I might be getting sponsored by Twitter soon. Hey, but, <laughs> yeah, yeah, right. yeah, yeah, you on yeah. the phone with them? Hey, man. I, my Email. people are talking to them. Okay. Because that's the only time you can access Twitter is on your phone. Right, 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 right. <laughs> phone, phone's off right now, so I can't be on the phone. But um, that's a whole other situation that I'm going through. How can but, we um, reach you, boo? It's all love. How long is it going to take them to get to this app? Oh, my, my Instagram. It's, uh, my Instagram is tangelo underscore one. That's T. Angel with an O. Underscore one. Okay. And then my, my, my Facebook is tangelo. That's T. Angel with an O. What His is name that? is T. <laughs> the hey, angel. You got your T. You got your T. You got an angel. Hey, you got your A. You got your. You got your O. Oh, you <laughs> need to hurry up and go. Leave that I one said in it. Wakanda. What? <laughs> They wouldn't Wakanda. even let, Oh yeah. They wouldn't it, even it, let that into Wakanda. James the one who got the Wakanda love. All right, so you can find me at JM <laughs> Fence Music club. everywhere. Okay. Wakanda <laughs> love. That's on Twitter, that's on Instagram. That's anywhere you guys do social media, I'm there. You can um, find me on uh JM Fence Music everywhere. Yes. Um and yeah, I'm getting up what I'm getting us? up in my snaps I too. Say that. I what about be able to us? Say and that. definitely you can also find us the, the Our perspective. Odd perspective. Yeah, yeah man, talk about the Our Perspective podcast on Facebook, the Our Perspective podcast on Instagram, and then you also can what? What do, you, what do you have to say? Why is that our name? We're not even that odd, bro. Jesus Christ. You or you can find us the reason on Twitter. Why odd is in the name. <laughs> or you can find us on Twitter <laughs> at iPerspective underscore. And if you want to email us, you want to be a sponsor of the show, if you yes. want to come in and, like, you know what I'm saying, hang with us and talk to us for a little bit, if you want to be a part of the serial supporter segment, if you think you know all the words in the Bible and in the book <laughs> and in the dictionary, so or, you want to tell, or the words of the week, if you just got it online. I online. think I kind of was getting there, but that's okay. If you know all Ooh. the words and you want to let pe- Brittany, you want to tell Brittany to her face that you know it, you can email us at the Eye Perspective you pay at them. Yahoo. No podcast. The Eye Perspective at me? Yahoo. Yep. I like his idea. I don't even know if they heard it, but one more time, it's the Eye Perspective at Yahoo. And we're also, every week, Wednesdays, on GorillaCross.com. You guys tune in, download the app. It's free. Music going on all the time and great shows all throughout the week. Um, so is that good? Everything, where where can we find you this week? Um, I'm, 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 I'm at home because my foot is still <laughs> hurt. <laughs> shout out to your... You know what? Let's give some shout out to your... Your foot. Yeah. Because I, I mean, cause, cause I, I he over here yeah, working. Yeah, my right foot, foot is foot on. Today. My right foot is on overtime right now. Can I get a waterfall of that? Jesus no. Christ. A water. Thank you for saying that. So I think we've e- done. E- I e- well, I just want to sh- real quick where everybody can be. Uh, what, what everybody has going on this week real quick. Icarus, what do you have going on this week? <laughs> <laughs> Of course, we have Funny Bones live uh, this Saturday, 8.30 p.m. inside the Classic Jewel. Tickets, you can find them on Is that- Eventbrite. Can I perform? Funny Bones. <laughs> no, you're not a comedian. I am funny. No. You are Watch funny. Tiangelo, are please you? Go. Please go. Are you? Please. Bones are funny. 
Please go. Funny Bones. Will That's you, why I should be. So you, you got be, Funny Bones? Funny Bones, 8.30 p.m. Get your tickets early, please, because this this always sells out. Definitely. Dope. I, I will be at, I may be at Cork and Thorn performing this Friday, actually. Figure um, some stuff out. There's a possibility. I just got called today. So if not, either way, there's going to be, it's Most called decorated. Flowers, Wine, and R&B. So either way, um, oh, that's, that's, we'll have some love going on. It'll be myself decorated. or Big Bruce. She'll be there doing some new dance. Hey, stuff. I want to talk to Big Bruce, too. So that's <laughs> yeah. perfect that you said that. Rebre, you're out here just for just the Stella Awards. Time. Give him the information. Yeah, or, that, you obviously, like you said, you can find them hashtag Rebre33C, but tell them about some shows. And that's what we're going to, that's what we're going to cheat at. We want you to tap into them social media. There you go. That's what we post them at. Yeah. We got a lot of things going, going on. on. We got a lot of showcases That's going right. on. We don't want you to cheat and listen. We want you to tap in and get in that social media and support the social media. Definitely. Not, not the social media that got the fights up and everything, but people that's doing positive yes. things. Right, man. You and you don't look at and fights. I pre- and I appreciate this platform to be, you know, you guys being a voice for the people. Absolutely. Yeah, man. As many voices as possible. Yes, sir. And like I said, moving by the masses, that's how change happens. We're we going to do some work together, man. Well, definitely, man. We're going to do some work So you've tuned in one more time. It's another week of the Our Perspective Podcast. My name is James Mays. I'm Brittany Soul. Oh, I am T. Angelo. <laughs> I read the clause. <laughs> and we are the Our Perspective Podcast. Thank yes. you for listening. <laughs> you better sing, T. Closure. I don't want to give to. Maybe he got to sing.